Hello, everybody out there in YouTube land. How are you tonight? Hello, Monday. We're live uh, today. I can't do such a happy Monday. That's Xenia. <laughs> That's her shtick. Hello, Monday. We're starting our live show week. That's um, right. Oh, there we go. Continue. <laughs> I'm just opening up the pop-up chat. <laughs> We're a husband and wife team making videos and photos at the same time getting up close and personal with YouTube creators from all around the world. That's Every night from Monday to Saturday at 8 p.m. Eastern, we're here on Live with Pusha with our special guests and awesome you in the chat. That's right. Welcome. Oh my welcome. God, my hair. I was, we're literally still doing renovations around here, so I do yeah. apologize. Just a little <laughs> touch-ups today. Uh, yep. For those of you who have been following us, uh, we have been doing a little Reno, uh, little living room, little bedroom, little hallway, kitchen. Yep, a little bit here and sound, there. doesn't sound little, uh, yeah. almost every room in the house. <laughs> But, uh, Doesn't feel little. <laughs> yeah, so uh, so that's what we are up. Uh, we are on our last day of the long weekend here in Canada. That's right. Uh, it's Victoria Day uh, in Canada. In Quebec, it's Patriots Day. So happy Victoria uh, Patriots Day. Um, no. Happy Victoria Day. Hope you, you had a great long weekend. Uh, we had an awesome weekend. They said it's going to be raining, but it's going to be sunny and beautiful, beautiful weather. This is true. Uh, all four days, and we were out today. Um, First time out this whole weekend yep. where they're doing stuff. Uh, yeah. If you want to see what we've been up to and how did we look today, go to our Twitter and check that out. There is a, a an awesome picture from us from today. <laughs> I, <laughs> I so don't like yet. selfies. Xenia talks to me. Or, or, actually tricked me into them yeah more um, like tricks i don't really like them either but you know that's what they say <laughs> it's good it's good to do so we're Andrea. gonna try i still am trying to figure out how to hold phone and take picture at the same time from a good angle because this angle is not good uh, mostly people do it from underneath here and not good i don't have to take it from top here because that's the most flattering one but then how do you press the button <laughs> Uh, so if any of you have tips on that, please uh, share, because uh, I'm still trying to figure that one out. The tip is not to do it. Yeah, well, 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 well. <laughs> gotta, gotta, gotta go with a modern day, you know, That's right. uh, trends, so to say. That's what I'm all about, <laughs> setting trends. That's setting my passion. Trends. That's um, right. Uh, yeah, and uh, we're going to say hello, hello to everybody who is here. Yes. In the meantime, uh, if you are up to it, uh, share our live stream to Twitter or any other social media you're on. And <laughs> and if you are too I'm lazy, if you're too lazy to press that share or like button or both, uh, just go to our Twitter. I just posted a link in the chat and reshare our poster for today. Thank you so much. Uh, oh my God, <laughs> uh, it wasn't even. You're too kind, way too kind. But thank you very much. She's very good. Tonight. <laughs> uh, thank we, you. we just feel really tired. <laughs> um, now I'm going to fix uh, Kasumi's uh, blue wrench. Um, oh, yes. Uh, hello, hello. Uh, I <laughs> seen you uh, last week on one of the streams. So thank you for coming back. Yes. I much appreciated that. Definitely. So, who do we have today uh, right now? We have. Badger Farm Girl, hello. Welcome. Beauty and the Bird. Welcome. I just love the name. So, so sophisticated. It is. Urban Debate Tourist, hello. Where are you at right now? Where hello. are your travels, paid travels, yes. led you to? Kilos and Heathens, is it Neil or Annalise? Are you at the gym? Neil? <laughs> Are you at the gym? I'm laughing at uh, Hosier. If you're not at the gym, just remember, we don't go to the gym, but we hold you accountable. So <laughs> I hope you are working out. Uh, <laughs> oh, my God. Craft beer pours is in the house. Oh, special yeah. applause for them. Tonight. They had a, like a pro the other night. These poor guys try to have a stream, normal stream, just want to talk a bit, have a drink. Saturday. Saturday yeah. night. And they their channel gets targeted and not picking on German people. It just happened. It was a German channel that decided they were going to swarm in on them that night. And we, Xenia was going through, I think, just before bed. 
after we're done our stream. Yeah. After and you're like, wow, they're stream. doing good. They were, what, 70-some at the time? Yeah, I'm like, oh, guys are doing really well. Yeah. What's going on there? What's so the I went secret? and checked it out, and uh, <laughs> la, la, la. <laughs> we get in there, and they're getting swarmed. I mean, their poor moderator was just delete, 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 delete. Yeah. And it was crazy. It went on for good. And they handled it like champs. Champs. I, I mean, so. so what they did have, they had around 60 uh, German trolls yeah. Uh, uh, yeah attacking their live stream uh was quite interesting they also went on live uh mm. since they posted the hangouts link in the chat so <laughs> so the, the german trolls tried to go on live and talked a little bit too so that yeah. was quite interesting one of them offered to eat uh, his uh wife's skin which was interesting and stuff like that you know all kinds yeah. of normal day-to-day -day youtube stuff nothing out of the ordinary so we were playing yeah. have the night warcraft basically delete ban a report yeah. delete ban report delete ban crazy. Report. <laughs> and uh, we're trying to get the likes up because they had an insane amount of dislikes obviously as well mm. that was quite an interesting live stream so you but guys did, yeah. handle it hats off to very you guys well. yeah um Hosier back, OD. Hello, Peter the Legend, our Welcome. small YouTuber news agency is in tonight. Oh, hello. Right. You were telling me. So this is oh, <laughs> yes. okay, okay. I heard about you. Hello, hello. Good Welcome to, to our live stream. Thank you so much for coming. Uh Kasumi, obviously. Um, as I mentioned before, Millie and Ashley is our yes. honorable guest for guest tonight. Hello Monday tonight. Yes. Uh, round of applause for We'll them. send you the link in Twitter in a few minutes. So. Yeah, say hi to them. Uh, Night shame. Hello. Hello. Uh, Went to your stream. Uh, yeah, we love your stream. I love <laughs> you. This is the most classiest act. Uh, I, I I just the voice. I could just listen all night. It's so like AM radio at night there, but that's like three. No FM radio. I got to give you credit now. You go right to FM. Yeah, and I feel like you are flying the plane. Like it feels yeah. like a, a Norwegian Airlines yeah. uh, pilot. You We're know, twenty two hundred. He's just got that. <laughs> got to check that out. Just the voice is amazing. Uh, Philip Cochran, are you making yeah. dinner? Uh, and Terrell, the original, of course. And ADJH travels just. Uh, popped in as well as well as the aquariums yes excellent just uh, uh what about a week or two ago i think we found each and other. bottle caps what are you making tonight oh bottle caps is here well good to see you with bottle caps we slowly start to uh uncover like a puzzle yeah uh, the way he looks because <laughs> <laughs> miss Bruce is looking hot tonight so there you go <laughs> <laughs> thank you and uh bottle caps my sister is back again tonight for a few minutes so i know you two got you two hit it off so yep. i just thought i'd mention uh, that. welcome jody welcome back you were still ladies susie and since if we all found out she's uh susie's married to doug he's kind of cooled his heels a little i think but still he hasn't given up completely so. no 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 yeah. barbecue chicken, chicken. Mm, oh yum 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 so we're gonna go and do our next show from bottle caps house yeah or he's gonna stop by uh during the formula one and yeah. still keep dreaming so <laughs> yeah <as laughs> Gator well, needs well, a blue wrench yeah did you yeah. did you do that did i what i just did oh okay <laughs> whatever happened there you see there you got jody with the heart oh <laughs> yeah. Oh, so guys, how a, how was your weekend? Mm -hmm. How was your uh, long or short, either or? Yep. Uh, how was your weekend? It's so what good to you see you all. Guys? We are not here on Sunday. We so missed you guys missed last you night. A lot. And you didn't miss a lot of fun. We painted. Yeah, we we're covered in paint. Watching live streams, I uh, watched Helos uh, and Helos yes. live stream. Uh, that was ATGH Travels we watched, yeah, which was really good. Uh, yeah, so... Uh, watching and painting at the same time. We can't live without you guys. So. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, now, bottle caps are getting everybody hungry. Um, probably <laughs> we'll be sending picture, I would assume, soon, too. Ovi. Welcome, Ovi, by the way. Ovi Scott, the, them Germans are coming. Be careful. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. That, das can, that das can 23 is still coming over. <laughs> That's right. Um, Christy K9, hello, and Brocknix, hello, hey. hello. How's your restaurant business going? Did you guys open already? I thought it was around this time. Because there's Christy K9, and then her husband is something K9, and then you guys have a, a third channel? Wow. Pardon me for getting that channel. wrong, but I know it's something to that effect, which is very cool. Uh, ADJ Travels, awesome weekend, had a great stream except the trolls. Did you have trolls? Oh, you got too? trolls too. 
that's why I went to Night Shame's stream that uh, on Saturday uh, because I seen that he had a pretty good uh, crowd there, and I didn't want them to be disrupted. So I went in to to warn them about it, but that was later at night already. So uh, what was I going to say? Uh, bottle caps. Andrew lying uh, lying when he says he misses me. Well, of course I miss you. It wouldn't be a show without you. Oh no, Susie, Mary, caps. Doug, you knew that. We remember we found out like two weeks ago. Bottle caps. I'm sorry to tell you. Susie's married to Doug. <laughs> They're married in real life. How do you feel now? <laughs> Brock, yeah. uh, Brock Nex is here. Excellent. Our brother from Alaska. Great to have you here. Nathan, <clears throat> and I won't say Nathaniel is partial to percussion more. I will call you Nathan Likes Drums. So it's good to have you here. Oh, I Always thought you had a grand uh, opening of some sort. So you were talking about your wife and, hmm, did I get mixed up? I don't think so. I'm going to go to our correspondence and check that out. <laughs> oh, my God. Ball caps, you really didn't know. Well, one of our live streams, I think, uh, yeah, I thought a week you and a half ago, we were all of a sudden also shocked by these uh, news. Well, they're not news. They've been married for a while now. Yeah, we just didn't uh, know. But, yeah, we didn't know. Yeah, she like, said it like they all thought we knew. We were like yeah. shocked because yeah. even like a lull come like, over the crowd. Like we've been hanging around together for like two months. Yeah, yeah. And, and nobody even had an idea. And me doing the stripper music on top of her hostess cakes all the time. And then and I thought he's like, oh, don't worry. He goes, no, I can't pass the hostess. Yeah. But I don't music. think Doug minds. I no. mean, he, had, he made a gif of it. Uh, yeah, uh, no, yeah. he's as cool as go, go check Doodles by Doug or the Suzy channel and check the gif of uh, hostess cakes. Uh, quite mm. interesting. Uh, Nathan likes drums. Hello. Uh, welcome. Chris K9. <laughs> Chris K9 and Christy K9. I love that. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll fix the blue wrench thing too. Uh, there you go. Um, Bobby Scott went <laughs> live and had some Germans pop in spamming me. Oh, you too. Holy God, it was God. Good. Oh, uh, prep for it. Hey, how are you? And ATJ Travels also had the same German ones. We actually, we found, uh, well, uh, Craft Beers found their live stream. I found their head on Twitter. <laughs> so we were quickly dealing with them too, like uh, reporting them to YouTube and stuff. But I mean, they're going to pop with some other channels anyway. Prep for it is Canadian, if I'm not mistaken. I oh. Yeah, we met the other day. I was going through uh, just in time preppings. Just look, uh, or no, it was, yeah, it was in just for time preppings, a live stream. Mm. And we met a couple. So that was great. Uh, you guys, if you haven't had a chance to check each other out, it's always that we don't do that here, but it's it's a great byproduct. So, and uh, usually we wait for a couple of times to add uh, the wrench, but since he's Canadian, you know what? I feel Go he just gotta have one. I don't want to see him left out. <laughs> if you guys didn't know, we're in Montreal right now. So, yeah, uh, therefore a soft spot. For but I'm Canadians. but I'm a huge Federalist because I know he's from Kitchener, so I don't. I'm thinking I'm celebrating Patriots Day, whatever the hell they call it here in Quebec. So. Hello, Wincity yeah. Stevo. Um, always good to have you and your yeah. comedy. <laughs> ADJ travels watching with the whole family, and our uh, small YouTubers news had a good but short weekend. Yeah, wish you guys. Have you had Memorial. When is Memorial Day? Isn't it like in a week too? I forget. I you guys are having a long weekend as well uh, coming up, I think. Irvin to pay tourists. I had Pusha Studios withdrawal the last four days at home, not being able to watch y'all. No internet there. Oh, well, isn't that amazing? Oh, that's so nice. Well, we had withdrawals from you, my friend. So it's great to have you in here. It's great to have all of you in here. Uh, there's some new faces, so I'll say my usual stick. We add the wrench because everybody's respectful of each other. We have great channels in here, and we're all our own monitors. There's this place is a place of respect. So and that's why and we're glad to have you guys here. It's good to have a mix of new and old. Everybody gets the mingle. Yeah, Hamilton. Okay, sorry, I thought it was Kitchener. I think it was AK for. Yeah, three day weekend yes. coming up for you uh, for Americans. So uh, I, I know you guys are looking forward to it. So hopefully you guys are gonna have good weather. Um, Brockness is enjoying first commercial King Salmon run of the planet of the year. Oh, nice. Nice. One. Excellent. Yeah. I always, when I hear King Salmon, I think of that Discovery Channel show. Um, oh, my God, where they're up on the uh, Yukon River. Uh, 
It's a native territory. Remember the, the reality show we used to Yukon watch? Yukon Man? Is it Yukon Man? Yeah, that's yeah. right. That's right. Yeah. And I always think of King Salmon for them trapping them in that. Yeah. Those things are huge. We got, of course, Atlantic salmon here on this side, but the king salmon are gigantic. Trish D, hello. Hey. Bottle caps, I understand your broken heart. Yeah. Believe, <laughs> Stink believe us. Eye. It's not my fault. Uh, He's always accusing Xenia of giving him the stink eye all the time. But we were shocked, believe me. We were, yeah. and all the people that were in the chat at that time, we, we were like, we were already st starting to close yeah. our stream up and kind of like starting to finish it. And you gotta give it to Jim Apple. Yeah. There we go. This poor Jim. At first, he's a, he, Jim's a bit of a wild card, but he's been here enough. Yeah, times. don't mind Jim. Yeah. Uh, but, uh, <laughs> he gets a blue wrench nice. as well. Yeah. He's nice. Uh, See that to my sister Jody. You see that? There's me and her, and he actually thinks she gives the stink eye. So I think that's the funny part of all of it. <laughs> I figured you'd appreciate the humor. And yeah, way. no, it's interesting. But he doesn't mind bottle caps. So uh, <laughs> Weilberg calls my channel the Discovery Channel without Richard Attenborough. <laughs> what was that? Weilberg calls one. Oh my God, Almighty. Oh that's a good one. <laughs> oh, Brenda's Beauty Blog just hit 1K. Excellent. Congratulations. Good stuff. That's so great to hear. Yes, you're a Joker card. Yeah. You never know what's going what's to come yeah. out. <laughs> um, Do you want to put out the Twitter once more? Yeah. And uh, not because they're lazy. No, she they says are. It. Well, everybody are a little bit lazy. Oh, my God. I, oh my. I know. I am. I die a little inside. Each okay, time. so share that stream. Or if you're too lazy to do that, just <laughs> go to our Twitter and reshare our post. Oh, I'm glad to clean this it live up. stream. The more, the merrier. Uh, <laughs> Unreal. Get those people know. <laughs> Great if motivator. You're, if you're too, too lazy, just don't do that. Just mm -hmm. listen to us. Use us as a podcast. It's all yeah. good. We appreciate it, though. We do we appreciate do. that. It is a big help. So, <laughs> uh, I want to pronounce it right. D Aqua Aqua Aquarinas. Oh my god, I'm so worried I'm not pronouncing that right. Oh, I hope I'm close. I get my clock. Yeah, okay, but now it's time to go for get ready for bed, you. <laughs> and for all the kitties, it's time to brush their teeth. Yes, I don't know what lately, and now she's just trying to get on all the time. I think like. after that time that we, uh, she co hosted there. Yeah, yeah, she got the, the bug now. She, now she wants to be in front of a camera. Morgan so. Hawkins, welcome. So good to have you back. Thank you for coming. Thank you, be thank you, Beauty, for tweeting it out. That is so appreciated. The tweeting is a big help, guys, because you get to reach sometimes to some of your uh, your followers who don't know about us yet. And if everybody does that, we always bring in new ones that everybody can meet. So, Rosa Frasso, what's up? Hey, how are you? Uh, Obi Scott, thank you. Uh, Andrew just murdered that name. I know. <laughs> I know that. Uh, I was terrified to say it. <laughs> they want to cut off my skin. Yeah, well, that's, that's the same trolls that were at the crab beer pours. Uh, um, yeah. On the crap beer they're points, yeah. just uh, you know, yeah. just but they're they're live streaming the live stream. I mean, and you know, we have a whole bunch of you guys here. If it happens to us, you know what to do, right? <laughs> have I, uh, Jim Apple? Have I asked you what kind of camera can you take a picture with and destroy stuff at the same time? I don't know, but I'd love to know what it is. <laughs> so if you find out, please let me know. Yes, Thank model you for caps. On Instagram. <laughs> oh yes, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, now we live in Oreo. Yeah, that's right. We live right. inside Oreo because uh, we have our trims are dark brown, and this is kind of like this cream frosting uh, shade. So I feel like I'm living in Oreo cookie. So. Well, I think it's about that time to send the link over. What do you think? Sure. Helos, Helos. I, I still don't know if you're at the gym. I want to hold you accountable, as I was saying, on our stream and yours on Saturday. want to know if you're at the gym. You should be. So, see you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, almighty. Oh <laughs> Thank you, DJ Travels, and everybody else stuff. who tweeted out. Uh, yeah. Yes, we do, we do miss the yeah. walls too, but now it's Oreo, so why not? Let's get from orange. Oh, A and W orange walls. That's true. I never really thought of it, but yeah, it was kind yeah, of. Yeah, I never thought of that too. It's actually yeah. it's orange rust, uh, the original. I know uh, yeah. uh, Reese's uh, 
Reese was my wondering, like uh, he was asking yeah. like, for three different times, uh, and guessing. We've been seeing colors. Reese lately. I hope he's Reese not... is uh, trying to get some work for summer. Yeah, yeah. So he's uh, every so often he pops in, but he's more uh, focusing on on getting some work. Um, there we in go. Summer. So we not today. <laughs> it's Monday. the The weekend is gone, Neil. The link has been set and sent, <laughs> and our guest will be joining us very shortly. And Brenda, yes, it is a, a very special moment when huh. you finally get to that point. It's uh, congratulations again. It's yeah. well deserved, and it's displayed. a lot of work. You put in the effort, so yeah, you got yourself to pat on the back for that. Good for you. I'm not joking, Neil. You mm. you said that I can get you keep you accountable, and that's what I'm doing. That's what we're here for. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I. Uh, uh, <clears throat> uh, what is what is Monday? Oh man, Monday. Mm. Well, we are on holidays still, so mm. yeah. You notice I'm not getting so excited with the Monday thing. A cannon apparently is the 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 camera that you can destroy at the same time. Yeah, that works. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I use Sony uh, for my photography, so um, you know. <laughs> If you want to destroy a cannon, go ahead and do that. Reese was in Friday night for a short visit. Yeah, yeah. see, sometimes I'm looking or Xenia's looking. We miss somebody. We'll talk later on. It'll be yeah, like, he messages on Twitter sometimes and he pops mm. in. Uh, but uh, he could get, get the job for the summer. So mm -hmm. that's why he's off. Real life them. comes first. Uh, well, thank you for oh, coming. Yes. Our news, uh, <laughs> our news guy for small yeah, YouTubers. I think it's really cool what you're doing, by the way. I just wanted to say that as a side note, and thank you so much for coming. Yeah, we're here every night at 8 p.m. except yep. for Sunday with awesome guests from all around YouTube. Uh, today, Millie and Ashley is coming in, uh, so check us out again. Uh, we sent the link, by the way. Uh, uh, so just waiting for you to click on, and we're ready to go. Yeah, have a great Monday. Miss Pusha, how come I can't use video from my Canon SLR? Um, what do you mean by that? What, what do you mean can't use video? Yeah. It's a very broad question. Some kind of weird format. D what, what, did you look at the extension, what it is? You probably oh, got okay. you, you to pass it through uh, the bridge or the Lightroom in order for it to convert, I would assume. But really, Premiere should be able to open it, too. So what, what is the extension? You love making the woods, and I will definitely mm. be back. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, uh, oh, yeah. Uh, take care, sis. Talk to you soon. Thanks for coming by. Don't forget to say bye to bottle caps. Yeah. Uh, okay, Millie, make sure that you guys are uh, signed in um, uh, with your Google, the same one that you use for your YouTube. And you just press the link, it should be fine. If not, uh, tweet us um, in the message your email address, and we'll try through your email. Yeah, the email that you use for Google Hangouts, and yeah. just send it in Twitter. Don't send it in here. Hey! Hello! Hello, girls! We're on. We're Hi. live. Hello. Wait, why don't Okay. Hi. How are you? <laughs> we good. We're good. Oh, there you go. That's, there we go. Yeah, there you go. Hey. That's and now we can see you both. There. How are you? Hi, we're good. good. How are you? Doing good. It's so good to have you guys on. <laughs> it was kind of complicated to connect it. Well, you did it. Hi, how are you? <laughs> he said, how are you? What's your name? Destiny. Well, it's a pleasure to meet you. How are you tonight? Good. Are you excited <laughs> to be on the live stream? I can't find my Yeah. Oh, sorry. We got our daughter standing here. I can't uh, find my Okay, well, <laughs> say hi to her too. <laughs> Audrey, they said hi to you. Yeah, she's half naked, so she can't yeah. really come in. No, no, you're not coming like that. I'm trying this. to read the chat from the other phone. Just so that we you want this. Can okay. I have this? Are you mommy? showing them the video? Mommy, can no, I have they this? can see us and we can see them. Yes, I want that. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, so how so are you guys tonight? What's, 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 what's going on? Okay, I think there's a spider again in the room. Oh, uh, so oh, and it's going to go. Oh, no. <laughs> I'll be back. Uh, oh, we had our long weekend, as, as we were saying. Uh, I, you guys uh, have the three-day weekend coming up, yeah? Oh, for Memorial Day weekend. Yeah. Is it, yeah. Is it next oh, weekend? Oh, yeah, 28th of yeah. yeah, next weekend, 28th of May, yes. Okay, well, that's good. <laughs> long weekends are always great. I think I think you guys went out. I, I can't see you guys. We see a green a green thing. Oh, look, we see ourselves. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, the... <laughs> wait, no, can you what? see and hear us now? No. no. We see well, wait, we can hear you, but we can't see you. Yeah. Uh, well, it's going to change from you to us. Oh. Can okay. you see me now? <laughs> No, we still just see um us on the bottom and then your green thing. The hangout icon. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, well, uh, are you watching us through the hangouts or through YouTube? Through, through both. Both. But the one on YouTube is kind of it's slow. It's behind. Yeah. Well, uh, uh pause the YouTube no. one. Uh, the uh, yeah, just pause it. The chat okay. will. Still Will be running real time, the so will still go. Oh, okay, all right, no problem. That works. Uh, and watch uh, just Hangouts, like listen and watch through Hangouts, but uh, watch. Uh, um, yeah, the chat. The, that, that's, okay. that's what she's. Okay. Okay. So yeah, I don't know why you guys can't see me because I can yeah, see it on YouTube though, so it should work. We don't see you. We just see the Google Hangouts icon. Yeah. <laughs> that's really weird. Like I know I don't even know like that. That. but uh, that's okay that's okay no, well we can see you and the main thing the people in the chat can see you uh, that's yeah. what you're for by uh, the way hi everybody in the chat <laughs> I'm trying to hi follow everybody up. we're yeah we're trying to like look at every comment to see who's here oh I see oh, you guys hi you. you're back <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> Spider's <laughs> gone. I'm back. Sorry about that. <laughs> Andrew, Andrew came back, and now we are able to see you. I don't know. I guess. He... Oh, there I brought. Oh, the I think it's him. I think it's him. It was, his, magic. It was his fault. <laughs> That's gonna go in my head. So you gotta be careful. Yes. You do. <laughs> Oh, it's so good to have you guys. You guys are one of those, another one of those channels since way back when we first started, kind of uh, building up. So it's great yep. to have you guys on. Yeah, it was nice. It was good to see your channel grow the way it did. So, it's oh, nice. you guys as well. I mean, you guys have been putting in the effort. You know, I've been watching it. You know, and you got great content. You know, you guys really put a lot into it. It doesn't feel labored, is what I like. Because a lot of family, not not a lot, but there are some family channels you can see them like pushing and pushing to make it something that's not. Yeah, I like the way you guys do it. It's clean. It's nice, but it's not fake it's you guys as far as i can tell anyways if it's not yeah, you yeah. fooled me very well it definitely is not scripted when we do the vlog oh, no. the we just, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, like, everything is just whatever, whatever happens, 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 happens we record it and then there we go well that's yeah. cool i mean that's what it should be in my opinion you know especially family vlogs because it's yeah. not just for youtube views it's also something your kids can see years down the road you know it's exactly. a it's a living legacy so yeah, that was the main reason why we did the channel is for our memories, for ourselves. And we're like, and if other people want to watch it and they enjoy it, then that's good. <laughs> that's right. It's a byproduct, not the main focus. So. Exactly. <laughs> Especially us as a long distance, like we like way back and then we rewatch the video, oh, we watch the video. And, yeah. <laughs> oh, so by the way. <laughs> I was going to leave yeah, that for a minute. Just I was going to let that's people wonder for a few minutes. <laughs> <laughs> so we're doing now a like, 12 hour challenge, hang talk. This has been a challenge for real. <laughs> can't even go to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, nice. It has been an ordeal. Oh, that's amazing. No, because I was going to leave it alone. I've seen it, and I'm like, I'm going to wait and see what the chat kind of comes up with, you know, and then we'll go from there. Yeah, I'm surprised nobody did it. Nobody hasn't mentioned it either. So that no, was... that's right. Because, you know, it's one of those things that nobody wants to say and say anything that might offend. So they're all thinking like, about yeah, it. I don't what's happening over there, but Why okay. are they <laughs> No, guys, well, it's part of the challenge. It's actually it's one of the YouTube challenges. It's like handcuffed. It's supposed to be handcuffed for 24 hours. But that oh. was long. Yeah. So so we did it at, well, she did it. I didn't even know she was, she just came out of nowhere and placed the handcuff on my arm. Well, she was cooking. While I was that cooking. was the, the worst ever because I was like getting burned with the fried chicken. <laughs> oh, oh my, my God. God almighty. I'm like, oh my God, no, no, get it out. 
And these are the real ones, like legit. There's no push button to take it off. There's an actual no key. No keys. Oh That's my key. god. So I don't know where the key is, and she does. So I'm legit stuck like this until she decides to take it off. Oh my god! So just help me now. Me. <laughs> I have the ideas going oh, already. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, Unless you want me to go with you to the divorce lawyer. <laughs> then I get Hank off soon. You better watch it. <laughs> well then. Okay. Oh my God. Well, we could maybe do for an hour or something. Like, oh. you know, just start with something shorter. So girls, when did you start your channel? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, you know what? Hold on. This is <laughs> no, 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 that's it. You, can you take it off for this life or not? <laughs> I would chew it off. So I'll be gone with the last of the teeth I have left. They'll go. It's heavy. It is heavy. It's oh, plastic. It's steel. I don't expect my teeth to make it. I'm just saying. <laughs> but you're going to try to take it off. That's right. No matter what. Oh, my God. You'll see ambition out of me that you've never seen before. So. <laughs> Uh, this is so good. Make to sure have you go that. live during that, though. We see yeah, go live. Yeah, because we're like, ooh, look at that. Look at the teeth. Look at them teeth. <laughs> oh, God. Winston, he said you two should walk back and forth in front of police station for an hour and see what happens. <laughs> so I was, I was thinking actually, I was actually thinking because I, I just got here today. So I was thinking of like handcuffing her like as soon as I saw her like. But then I don't know if, like, actually walking through a police, we get in trouble because we're using real handcuffs, you know? Yeah. Like, oh, so what's going on? So like, I was you know, at me. That's what's going on. That's like, right. Then, like, that's she, right. She might be, the police might be saying, like, oh, no, she's acting like she's okay, but she's not okay. I'm like, no, I don't want any trouble. Let's just do it in the house. <laughs> I'm just glad you don't have orange jumpers on. We'll just say that. Oh, oh God. God. Like, oh, no, they didn't, they didn't just escape from prison. <laughs> Oh my, oh my god. So you see there's nothing to be nervous about here. You're doing great. <laughs> well, I, I know we were a little nervous. Uh, maybe I was. It was just me. I was nervous. Oh, no. He's going one way. I can't go anywhere else. He can't go anywhere else. I can't. It's not like that. No. I have to stay there. All right, so you no. guys put so take turns. Take turns then. So let him play and then Okay, that's it. You see, families are families wherever you go. Yeah, yeah. There's you no, know, there's no, happen. there's no filter. There's no like pause button. It's yeah. real, and that's it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if we could only be that age, that way, all our lives. Eh? God. <laughs> <laughs> Even when you tell them, like, listen, we're live. Like, put the voices low. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it was the good here. Last, I gotta the first say. Five minutes, and then after that, what happened? Well, especially you guys, because you're coming together, you know, like in a way, and that's so there's always kind of like that coming home feeling, and that even for the kids as well, and that. Yeah. So definitely, I'm sure raises the energy in the house. Mm -hmm. Oh, they were super. She surprised them because they didn't know that she was coming. Well, the little ones didn't. The bigger one did. And we oh. went to school to pick them up. And when they came into the main office and they seen her one by one, they like ran to her like, "Oh my god, you're here!" <laughs> you gotta love those surprises. I can keep okay. Let me, let me keep talking. I love the hand you know. thing. As long as it's not me, I love it. <laughs> I don't think you said that because I'm so. Oh, I was about... gonna stress it. Don't worry. I'm so thinking. <laughs> as you're stressing that in her mind, she's like, "Oh, don't he doesn't he just wear his little pretty head?" <laughs> <laughs> well, ladies, it's been really fun getting together, and I hope to do this again soon. <laughs> It's that time already. <laughs> she's gonna have like a huge, she's gonna have the most fun and you're gonna be like, I'm gonna get million Ashley. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for real. I'm gonna troll your channel after that. <laughs> <laughs> oh damn, hold on. <laughs> Are you gonna you gonna I'm gonna put a bad comment right here? So now follow on my listen. <laughs> do not try this at home because we tried it and look at what happened. <laughs> Oh, you guys are too funny. Uh, this is so I guess we'll start with the channel a little bit. We'll go back and like, I mean, we've already kind of covered a bit, but you guys want to go in about what you were thinking when you started the channel, how long ago, what were your goals with it? I think yeah. Because there was some uh, idea to start the channel. Today. Okay, so it's since the beginning, I was like, oh, we should make a YouTube channel um, because I just like the vlogs and the, like the going on, like just to keep our like a, a track of our lives. 
and the memories. And I just wanted it to like just post videos, and then so we could watch it while we were in distance, like what we did together, and just like vlog it and just store it basically on YouTube, like not to be public. And um, so everything was dragging and dragging. I'm like, so when are we gonna do it? So when are we gonna do it? So when are we gonna do it? And then at the end, I decided, so we're recording today. <laughs> today and we're gonna start today i don't care oh. and then that's how we started and then now the most involved is her that yeah i am the one that watches everyone lives i am that the one that comments work, yeah. i'm the one that watches because she's always at work 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 and then she's like so who did work, you comment work, on today work, work. <laughs> i'm familiar with everyone with mostly everyone in the chat and you guys and then i just put her on like so this is this person this is this person yeah. and she's like oh <laughs> I work 10 hours a day, so I wake up, and then I go to work, and then like that. So she's like, okay, so this happened, and this happened, and I see the comments. I see the comments that, that um, you guys put on the YouTube, and then I see the answers and everything, but I can't respond or something. So I'm like, oh, so I see this, so who's this, so who's this? All right, so what's what was the video about? Oh, so that's interesting, and I see one or the other. Nice. Yes, yeah, like she's the one that does the networking, and then she's the one that. Samuel Moore. And who, who does who does the Samuel editing Moore. mostly? Huh? Who does the editing mostly? Like edits the videos. Who does mostly? Yeah. Mostly her. Mostly yeah. you as well. You see, oh, you wear many hats. <laughs> yes, I started bothering her. Honestly, yeah, I'm gonna be nice and raw and raw. Okay. I okay. I started bothering her maybe three videos ago, and I thought, and I was like, listen. On your day off, or I don't care when you get home, because she gets home at like 1 30 in the morning. Oh wow. And I'm like, I don't care. You better start editing and help me with this with this channel because I'm always networking and editing and <laughs> posting and everything. You better do something. This is your idea. <laughs> it's never ending, that's for sure. Yeah. So then I started uploading and then I'm like, okay, so I edited this, I edited this, this is the thumbnail, and da da da. da. And she's like, Oh, okay, so you're working now. I'm like, listen. Oh, thank you, Halo. I see. Have a good yeah. one. I'm trying to follow the chat, but it's hard. It's hard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a lot of a lot of people have been following you guys for a while, and you've been following them, so you know you get to know them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was telling her that when we was looking through the chat, I'm like, so I know them, I know them, I know them, I know her, I know him. <laughs> It is weird, like for us too, like because we're on like six nights a week, and then last night we're not. Usually we don't do Sunday, and we almost kind of start to miss everybody. <laughs> Oh, you know, bottle caps, he's so cr cranky, you know, and all, uh, Philip comes up with these great things. We have, like, you know, it's um, a bit like coming home, you know. Yeah. Oh, it's weird because we never always, we always said we never planned to do a live stream ever. This was yeah, I remember you said that before, a while ago, like, this was yeah. the plan. It was uh, kind of a fluke, so I, we never really knew how we'd feel about it, but it's weird. It kind of grows on you with everybody. It's a real community that way. Yeah. You know, I there's like, because we got it's like a little family that we build. Yep. Because we're like, oh my god, this person is back. Oh, this person is back. Yep. We're kind of familiar with each other. So, and then we're also still networking and communicating with other people. So, and it's nice. Like, you know, it's nice to have a foundation for your work. It's great to see new people coming in, but it's nice to have some regulars that you always know, like what you do, come in and support. So, it's a good, uh, it's a good feeling. Yeah. It's a byproduct of YouTube that we never expected, I guess. So, you know. Yeah. Uh, when did you guys start your channel? How long ago again? January 20th of this year. That's what I thought. You never even were in 2017 at all. Like you didn't have another channel or nothing. Nothing. Nope. We just jumped right into it. Oh, yeah. Oh, I know. That's it's unbelievable. Amazing. We just jumped yeah, right we're into almost it. at what? 800? We're almost at 800. Yeah. yeah. It, and fast. <laughs> like, you know. Like, it's yeah, really it's fast. Fast. Even, even me, like I'm looking at the, at the YouTube channel I'm like, huh. But wait a second, baby. Like, what? Oh, we just oh, made four, we just made four months on YouTube yesterday. Wow. wow. Um, you really doing well. Yeah. Good for you guys. Well, we love we love all the support, you know. Yeah. And we enjoy yeah, it. Definitely. And we try to do our best to like give the support, the exact support back. Yep. So it's yeah. it's hard sometimes, you know. We kind of go through that guilt. Oh my god, it's hard. And like we just uh, we're actually I think fifteen right now away from fifteen hundred. Oh, see, yeah, 1500. Oh, 1500. Wow. We had, had in... forty two in February. Well, then, look oh, at that. Wow. <laughs> yeah. But wow, that's a tremendous growth right there. Yeah. But you know, I'm starting not to be able to support as well as I used to. You know, and I go through this tremendous, I, it is anxiety because I really feel bad. And then I'll spend a whole Sunday, one time, what was it, like 12, 13 hours all together? Yeah. Just going through, uh, going through the, uh, the chat and replying to anybody who watched. So, 
it does get it's harder, hard. but it's very time consuming. Like so, so I won't say hours because I, like I said, I'm the one that does all the watching. She mm. watches only like the big, like major YouTubers, like Ace Family and mm. L and S and Damo and Chrissy. She's everybody watching else, for the I trends. Everybody else. So I watch our like um like our favorites. Then I watch our top supporters. Then I watch like really close friends, and then I do randoms. So it's like in an order. So right. I make sure. But I start feeling bad if it's been a certain amount of time and I haven't reported back to someone's channel mm -hmm. to like show some support back, and I'm like, oh, I feel so horrible. Like, <laughs> but yeah. it's so time consuming. It's it is. Time consuming. And it's not that you don't care about them, and it's not that you don't want to see them. And I know this yeah. with us. And sometimes I'll go on to one that's been two weeks, and I'm like, you know, I'm so sorry. I just seen them post somewhere. I'm like, oh, my God, I haven't seen him in ages. Yes, or, exactly. That's exactly what happened. Or like, YouTube like, unsubscribes us. I haven't seen you in a long time. It's like a big apology letter, you know? Yes. <laughs> I'm like, I haven't shown love in so long, but, like, I'm here. I'm still supporting. <laughs> still care. Nothing bad. Yeah. Because sometimes people might think, like, um, you know, a lot of people get empty subs, and we yeah. don't like that. Like, we're definitely not okay with sub for sub. Like, we don't, we're not okay with that at all. We don't do right. sub for sub. Because we feel like that brings empty subscribers to our channel or to anyone's channel, yeah. and it's not going to help you in the long run. That's right. Going to damage you. Yeah. Yeah. So, they're gonna YouTube is gonna erase them. Okay, so they don't. Well, that's it. Exactly. You know, yeah. it's not losing sleep over them. If they join my channel, I won't throw them out, but I won't go after them, yeah. begging and crying to come. Yeah. I'll go yeah after exactly. Channel. Exactly. And what I can do a lot is like say you guys' channel, a channel I like. Well, then I'll. Oh. Are, are you guys still there? Yeah, we're here. Oh, we got some pink. And what happened? Purple. I can actually see the pink. Yeah, we can see we can see the pink, but what happened to the camera? Uh oh. Oh, it's like the encoding or something. What the hell? The encoding. Oh. Um, how do we fix that? <laughs> oh god. That's okay. There you go. Damn. You're about well, we didn't do anything, but <laughs> Well, whatever you did, you did well. Or what yeah, you did do, you did the well. Camera and put it back up. That's it. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> we just did that for suspense, folks. That was planned. Yeah, exactly. It was like, whoa, what yeah. nothing. <laughs> we kind of got a pen and teller thing going tonight. We just want to keep your eyes. So. <laughs> she's still trying to pick at those cuffs. I watch her now and then. She's not enjoying as much as she pretends. <laughs> right? It's like, dang, like my wrist. Oh. If it was me, it would look like one of those old Roadrunner uh, cartoons. You know when they get in a fight and there's just a ball of dust? Well, that oh, would be... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'd be in like a panic attack. <laughs> oh. So I'm trying not even to look at them and I don't even... I'm not the one wearing them and I'm trying to make eye contact. I'm like, well, I don't know how people like go and yell, use them all the time. Is this oh. I know. <laughs> this is a good get the kids to wear them for a weekend. We're gonna do the same <laughs> right? real life like, lesson for them all. If you like misbehave. <laughs> it's like when I was in college, I used to work at a car wash. It was a pretty affluent area, and the parents used to bring their kids in the weekend to show them what happens when you don't go to school. So, <laughs> Put it through <laughs> yeah, it was, was, See what happens when you don't go to college. <laughs> so, oh my god, really? <laughs> Oh, oh my god, god old lady. What happens when you don't go to school? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what happens when you don't go to school? I'm so lost. That car wash, oh. yeah. No, I worked at a car wash when I was going to college as part time. Oh, and okay. it was a glass wall, and it was a pretty rich area. And the parents used to all bring their kids with them on the weekend to get their cars watched. And you could hear some of them see what happens when they didn't go to school where they are. That's why you got to go to college. Well, and damn. Yeah. You wash expensive cars and just dream about them. You like hit them backwards yeah. and forwards. That's it. Yeah, that's right. Well, he's not getting his change today. <laughs> so disrespectful. Oh <laughs> Listen. Oh my god. You gotta be so mean though, mac and cheese. <laughs> so, so, uh, so how how often do you guys get to see each other? Like roughly in a month. So this is the thing. We started when the long distance relationship started because uh, I we we weren't long distance all the time. Like we I actually lived like exactly. That. We li I lived in New York here for four years. Okay. Um, and then we started the last year actually when I already had planned to like move and I was already doing the move. Um, that's when I met her. Oh. So that's what we started dating when I had already planned to live in in Orlando. So um. So I moved, and then when we started the long distance, we made it a challenge to see each other at least every two months. Okay. But we can't resist it. We can't. We every month we've been seeing each other since October every month. 
Uh, it's not easy. It's not easy. And sometimes we go some some of the months like February and um, Mar the end of March and beginning of April. We, right. Where we stay together for like 12 days instead of three or four. Okay. So it's hard when we see each other for only three or four because it's just not easy when we have to actually like leave. So well, you guys are making... You are dedicated to it, and that's the main thing. I mean, it's, it's not an easy way, though, but I mean, I guess it kind of tests how dedicated you are to each other, and it seems by the handcuffs it's working. <laughs> <laughs> so well, if anybody needed proof, there you go. Give me 10 more minutes. I'll just, like, rip the wrist off. I'm like, listen, I need to go. <laughs> kind of a coyote thing going on. <laughs> Broke next at long distance is so difficult. It is. It really is not easy at all. No. I mean, we make not. it look easy, not only just for YouTubers, but in in real life, people always tell us like, "You guys make it look so easy, like that, da, da, da. It is not easy. But it's not easy because the reality is, we still have to say goodbye at a certain point and wait until we can say hello again in person. Yeah, sometimes we need each other, and then it's the distance. Yeah. And then well, as any couple would need each other at a certain point, and then you just wish like you have that person there to come exactly. for you, or exactly. so you could come for them, and then yeah. well, we not together is kind of like it hits home. Like, yeah, they're so far away. Do you think in the there's plans in the future to maybe end the distance? Like, oh for sure. No, but I mean, like, I mean, like, uh, I don't want to give you guys a time. But are you already no, starting? No pressure, to... but move now. I feel like that. <laughs> <laughs> no pressure, but you guys should move in tomorrow. So I, I just want you guys to announce on our stream that you've officially decided you're not going back. I'm sitting. <laughs> this, this is my Maury Povich you know, moment. I wouldn't be against that. You know. <laughs> Oh, but yeah, definitely, definitely, I, we're planning um a year. We're we're giving us a year. Um, well, the year already has started. Well, the, well, ten months, <laughs> ten months actually. Yeah. Now, do you yeah, see I why I did this very lightly? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I listen. Yeah, because it's hard. Because it's really we, hard. I'm not gonna. We don't want to stay where I live in New York. But we we don't want to stay where she lives in Florida. We want to start off brand new in another state. So it's going to mean no family for any of us. I have the, the kids. We have to change the schools. So that's going to take time. Yep. So right. we can't take them out in the middle of a school year because that's not responsible. Of course. So it takes time. So literally, we're not able to move the kids out until June because that's okay. when the school's over. And that's going to be next June, though, because we can't, yeah, do, but, it. Yeah, we can't do it now. Yeah, next June. <laughs> Maybe you'll do change. Maybe you'll come to Canada. Well, then. Go completely over the top. I mean, actually, actually, because like I'm think, uh, like that's why we like the states, the options of states are limited because I'm trying to transfer from my job in Orlando, and then right. one of the offices is there in Toronto. Oh wow, there you go. Yeah, so yeah, she's like, limited on options because she heard the company she works for is very good. The benefits are great and everything, so we don't want to let her leave out the company. So we're definitely moving where her where there's still um like stations for her to be able to transfer to. Well, that's there you go. So that might be an option. Wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> oh, it's more. Yeah. It's Toronto. Just leave America. Just leave America. Good. Leave it. I mean, I'm down. I mean, we're not we next to New York anyway. So it's not like, oh, we're leaving to, I don't know, yeah. Russia or something like that. <laughs> I mean, at least we get to see the people. So. <laughs> right. Your choices between Toronto and. Uh, Nebraska. <laughs> no. <laughs> wow. That's Nebraska. That's Nebraska. What? <laughs> I just picked a state. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> oh, the option actually is Toronto, Michigan, and Seattle. Seattle. Oh, cool. Oh, yeah. yeah. Nice. So, yeah, then you, it's not bad options Seattle either. Seattle or Toronto. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, well. She's like, well, you know. Yeah, our main focus really was Seattle. Like, that was, like, the number one yeah. on our list was going to Seattle. So, we actually have... Like a trip coming up soon in a couple months where we're gonna go check out, uh, go talk to real estate people and uh, search out some apartments and things like that and see. That's we'll be fun. fine. So I really am. end up working closing the distance for sure. Like, oh, it's definitely. gonna happen. It's yeah. gonna be. Yeah, people, people think like long distance is forever. Hell no. 
And if, well, and if the goal isn't to close the gap, then that means you guys are not meant. To, oh, you guys are not serious about being together because yeah, nobody yes. wants to be separated forever. Like no, yeah. exactly. no, and there are some that do, and I don't know how they do it, and they're very happy at it. And dying I, already. No, yeah. no, 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 no. There is a, there is this new trend uh, uh, lately that people live in separate houses. They are together. They're even sometimes married, uh, and they live in separate houses. So they sometimes they spend time in their you know one's house, sometimes in the other. Sometimes separate, but they are together. It's not an open relationship. So that's that's great. It's like it's like instead of friends with benefits, it's like marriage. Marriage with benefits. What? Yeah, well, no, yeah, no, yeah. They have everything they else. Have it's not the same, but they have two different bills. You know, like they or they pay each other. Like they need they, their space or space. Yeah. Okay, so I need my space this weekend or something, and then they live by yeah. themselves, and then again, wow. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's a new trend coming. Uh, Twenty-five to thirty-five year old. Uh, they are doing it more and more like this. It's uh, quite yeah, interesting. Once, once we live in the same, wow. once we move from where we are right now, is to be together, and that's it. <laughs> Yeah. I do this. Go buy two houses, one next to the other, because I need my space. Yeah, all right. Yeah. <laughs> it looks nice going to work with you, handcuffed to her all the time. <laughs> <laughs> the handcuffs will come in handy, like, but where you think you're going? <laughs> oh my I'm like, god! I need my space, but where are you going though? Do I take my hand? Well, you guys both know that we were a long distance relationship, right? I didn't know no, that. I didn't know. That. No. And if you didn't mention that a long time ago, then I forgot. Well, it wasn't long. No, long but, but it was, but it was well, long the long distance long. was big, yeah. Because <laughs> Xenia's originally from Latvia, which is just beside Russia. Okay. And we met on a video game. And you met on what? A video game. Oh, I, we were, wow. I was in Canada and she was in Latvia, yeah. Wow. Don't tell me that one of you guys killed the other and you fell in love. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, why are you laughing? Is that right? Is that true? <laughs> wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Build a beam, build a beam. The story, thank you. The story. Chat, I just want to say, chat, you're welcome for the entertainment <laughs> right now. You are welcome. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> yeah. Well, ladies, it's been wonderful having you on. <laughs> That is the truth, though. We met on a video game. We stayed friends, and then I went over to Latvia. And I, said, I, over. I said, I'll be in, La in Europe for about two or three months, and if it doesn't work out, I'll come back home. We talked all the time on Skype. But yeah, we talked for 10 hours. We, we, had, we had a, a seven-hour time difference. So oh, like yeah, at night, my time was seven in the morning, her time. So basically, when I go to bed, she'd be leaving for work and vice versa. They kind of work that way. That part had to make it even more difficult. Yeah, that's that yeah. makes it more difficult. Like those so long distance relationships, I give them a trophy for that. Oh, you know, yeah. yeah. We didn't crazy. last too long. We gave in, and then I was on my way over, and we've been together ever since. But yeah, it was, yeah. And then instead of three months staying, uh, we stayed a month and a half, and then, yeah. uh, and then we just came here. And then I well, never said, yeah. That oh, was that's good. Oh, that's great. And look yeah. at you guys still together. See, that's right there showing that long distance is real. That's <laughs> right. <laughs> <Not> real. <laughs> they are able to work and last. Yeah. 
<laughs> Thumbs up for that's why endorsement. But that's why we can, like, I mean, our we're not the identical in your guys' scenario, but we do understand the feeling of it. You yeah, know, it's, it is hard. And I came out of a like a, a, I was ending my marriage. It was on the way out, and meeting Xenia made me feel good. But yet she's so far away. And what if it doesn't work out? What if immigration doesn't work out? What if visitor visas don't work out? It was expensive too. It was like two thousand. Oh, I can't imagine. Like just one, like return for one person. So it was a big investment right off the get go. You know. Yeah, and yeah you I can't imagine because you know. <laughs> I can't, I, I can't imagine because even us, um, we we are on the planning of moving and everything, so we need like apartment, school, everything like that. But at the same time, we need to see each other during those ten months. Yes, like it's That's not great. like we're not gonna see each other those ten months until we move in. So mm -hmm. it is expensive. Like long distance yep. relationship is expensive. <laughs> It, you yeah, don't realize it. I have to have that budget. Thank God for my job that gives me almost 20 day vacation pay. <laughs> That's excellent because it comes in handy right now. <laughs> exactly. And then I can do swaps and everything so I can have like long weekends and everything whenever I want it. As long as I can switch or have my days off. Then. So I've traveled in a year. I've been working there for like a year, a year and a month, a year, two months. And I've traveled almost seven times this year. Wow. Mm. It's a uh, long distance relationships either I think end pretty quickly or they show you just how strong a person can be. Yeah. You I mean, know? but it, it also, it also lets you, gives you the opportunity to know the person because that's the only thing you can do communication yes. because yeah. that's why you're in a long distance relationship. So you, you get to like know the person better. It's not all the time together and all the yes. time this and all the time, you know, like you have to communicate, you have to trust, you have to yeah. talk. And then that's how, like, our relationship gets stronger, so. Mm -hmm. Brotlix was saying, uh, you have to be secure yeah. enough with yourself to be able to mentally handle being yeah. 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 yeah, it's very well put. That's uh, very, that's yeah, absolutely definitely, true. Definitely, definitely. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah that's, that's the number one thing. Because if you know, you're insecure, and, don't yeah. even try a long distance relationship. It's not going to It's going to be a downfall. Yeah, gonna yeah. you're going to argue all the time. That's right. It's gonna be constant phone calls and fighting. That's all it will exactly. be. Exactly. It's like, oh, yep. so you didn't answer my phone on the second ring? What? <laughs> were well, you talking to someone else? Are you saying bye and then take, picking on my call? Oh, so it's a missed call. Why is a missed call? Yeah, too much. Yeah, so it's that's insecurity right there. So that can't. And I think too, if you can work it out and you can make it through it once you are together, right. you can handle a lot of things. Like the little things aren't so. Uh, a lot of couples then tend to like think in like little things happen to them. It's like the end of the world. Exactly. Going through this stuff, you tend to not sweat the little things as much. Exactly. You're more ready to take things on and and face on and together and not because you know you're a team. Uh, exactly no, because there them. were exactly because there were bigger obstacles that we had yes. to go through in order to live together. So those little th details that people argue when they're actually together, not long distance. Yeah, that, that's why we just like okay, so that's that, that can be we fixed. Look, we look past that. It. Exactly, we look past it. Like, yeah, is, that's why you guys aren't fighting tonight. Like, you know, oh, you forgot to take out the garbage because you're just happy to see each other because it's been a distance. So that's you know, those little things don't tend to be such a squabble. They're more. Uh, but it like, doesn't mean that it won't matter once you move in together. That those yes. things are not going to become big things. Of course, that's it's part of getting back to normal. Saying, well, you know what? Hold on, we're living together. Hold on. <laughs> so now you know you gotta better, you better take the trash out. Yeah, okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you heard it here, folks. And if they argue about it two years down the road, they can come back here to listen and see who agreed to what. So <laughs> <laughs> this is our life journal. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So uh, the, the, next exactly. live, the next live, we're going to have like a face like, so you didn't, so didn't take the trash out. Let's talk about that. <laughs> and the dishes, though, they've been, they've been there for like 10 minutes. Well, come on, like, who got to wash the dishes? Ten minutes. Ten minutes. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> See, Xenia and I don't fight about the dishes because the kids do them. So that's been all settled. Yeah. And and I, oh. I had Xenia on my hands and I couldn't. The doctor said I can't wash dishes for two weeks. So I'm like, yay, <laughs> let's try the kids. <laughs> and now they've been washing it ever since themselves. Like I sometimes oh, do it. But, oh my uh, God, you yeah. better give that, I'm gonna give a certificate on a war to that doctor. <laughs> 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 like I yeah. listen thanks to you, I don't wash dishes. <laughs> 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 Well, it's part of responsibility. We can always put it that way. Yeah, yeah. 
but it is. I do. That was important for my kids to learn to do something. So how old, uh, how old are your kids? Uh, our oldest is 20. Okay. Our, our son, our other middle son is 11, and our daughter is 7. Oh. So if anybody but, says you don't understand an age, we do. We've covered it at some point on the road. So, yeah. <laughs> right. It's like, okay, so you have a kid. Okay, starting over. Oh, never mind. Starting over again. <laughs> That I mean, they've been through every stage because it's 20 already. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. He moved here last year to Montreal and because uh, his mother, he was living with his mother and then with me. And now to have him on his own, it's so weird to have him drive up here in a car, have supper, and then go back to his house. Like, I'm still adjusting to all that, you know? Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, because he probably wasn't doing that before. He wasn't able to. Yeah, yeah I know. Going and then leaving. Or I can stick my nose in more than I went now that I can't as much as I used to, which sucks. <laughs> so I'm still adjusting to that part. I find a little weird, but <laughs> there. Bottle caps is talking about you guys' handcuffs. He said, "Hey, that's kind of kinky." That's kind of kinky. This the explanation. Well, part. if it's kind of kinky, we don't put it on camera. You know, that's like. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> too much. Too much. Too much. Too much. Too much. Like PG, come on. <laughs> only bottle caps, I'm telling you. Only bottle caps. <laughs> what did you say? I'm gonna keep it tennis. That was really like this kind of you said that you were, were uh other oh, reading it. Oh, oh, because he finally just asked what's with, what's with the handcuffs. Yeah. Oh, okay. He was back oh, and so forth. Whoever hasn't whoever wasn't watching before, it's a whole like YouTube challenge, like be handcuffed to your partner or whoever for twenty four hours. But we're not doing 24 hours. She just put it on me at six. It was without my permission. She just kind of slapped it on, put the key away. I cannot take it off. It doesn't have a push button. It's a real actual handcuff. Um, and we're going to do it until, I think, until midnight tonight. Midnight, midnight. Or until she tells me I'm free to go. <laughs> Maybe never. <laughs> Why? Well, free yeah. to go? Free to go where? <laughs> So there you have it, bottle cap. Sorry. So any dreams of Cinemax in your head are over now. So there you go. <laughs> yeah, this, is, this, is not, this is not controlment. Not <laughs> <laughs> Do you not so who's dominant? Oh, so the other submissive and all that stuff. No. Yeah, this is not, no, for, good, not for good TV. Good. One of you should have looked worried and every now and then mouth out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> It's like Morse code. That's great. Like Morse code, like, <laughs> write it down, please. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so, what you guys, uh, Jenny was going to ask you guys what you want to talk a little bit about how you met. No, okay. So I did the idea of the YouTube, right? So now you, how we met? Oh, oh we smart play. play. All right, so okay. Um, but okay, we met. Um, so when she was living here in New York, we both were working at Home Depot. Okay. We both were working there for three years. So we knew each other as co-workers, but we didn't even speak to each other. Like, it was, like No, we, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. You just, you just don't know how to, yeah, no, I'm kidding. Go ahead. <laughs> I've been trying to get her attention for the longest, but she okay. was always like, hey, like, hey. I'm like, what you mean with hey? Like, I don't understand. Like, so I'm trying and trying. And I'm like, you know what? I'm going to give up because this girl is just no hair with the hair. Like, you know, it's going to be tired. But then, Destiny, because it was Destiny. Well, not Destiny. No, 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 not Destiny. No, not Destiny. What did I do? No, not no, you. No, 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 you didn't do nothing. It's Destiny, fate, like Destiny. Fate. 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 Yeah, fate. fate. Okay. Um. Oh. So she was working at the electrical department, and I was working at customer service. So um, she was, like, running out of hours and all this stuff. So the manager said, like, you know what? We're going to put you in customer service where there's, like, more hours needed. I'm like, uh-huh, I caught you. <laughs> it's like an imaginary handcuff. Like, ha, huh, now you're in my department. <laughs> and then that's how it all started. So we started as we started as coworkers, then as friends, and then it then kept flirting, going. And then the dating, and then she asked me to be her girlfriend. And I was like, yes. <laughs> Oh, that's so and cool. Promise rings to everything, so yeah. Yeah, we already have promise rings. Yeah, we it's already all have her, It's all her fault. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's so nice. Yeah. It's all her fault. <laughs> it's all my fault. 
Listen. Well, it seems it seems like Home Depot was working a little magic for all of you. So in the right? end, yeah, for sure, for sure, for sure. Because you're gonna end up with the same amount of time. We were oh. working the same amount of time, and we actually started dating the last year. Yeah, it was you guys were working together, and we started flirting and everything right before I left because I was leaving Home Depot to become a teacher's a teacher's aide assistant. Oh. And, and I was like, oh, I'm leaving Home Depot. And she's like, oh, now that we're getting close, now you're going to leave Home Depot. And then two months after that, she ended up moving to Orlando. Cool. So we thought that we were going to, like, you know, no longer, like, stay in communication. Well, stay in communication, but friend-wise, not actually yeah. make the relationship work. But then we noticed that, no, we had to make the relationship work. Because yeah, no matter the distance, the feelings were still there. The love was still there. Everything was there. It was just distance was now included. It was actually, like, getting deeper and deeper. And we are like, oh, no, we can't get out of here now. <laughs> That quicksand feeling, I call it. Exactly. So, that's, that's, so it wasn't that's... it wasn't planned or anything. Like it was just like, oh, we're just like a little like just just oh, we're flirting and that's it. Exactly. But it turned into something else, and I was like, well, there you go. Uh, so you guys are gonna end up on a Home Depot commercial someday when they find out about <laughs> exactly that. Like, oh, that's cool. it's like Home Depot gets people together. <laughs> I'm like, listen, pay me for that. <laughs> They always ask like this question, would you get married where you met? And I'm like, well, we're going to have a Home Depot wedding. <laughs> it's going to be like Home Depot themed, thanks to them. You know, we're going to go to Home Depot to see if they sponsor us. We got to we wear the arm and shape with the top of the dress. Oh, listen, what? You crazy, girl. Home Depot. You know what? It's going to be instead of white dresses, orange. Orange, orange dresses. No. Oh, my God. Yes. Oh, my yes, God. yes. 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 <laughs> yes. Oh, yes. Listen, we no. got to be yeah. unique instead of yeah. white orange. Or who who marries in orange dress? Who marries yeah. in orange dress? Don't get me wrong, it might be some really beautiful orange dresses. Yeah, there you go. We can make it. But because I'm a really think of Home Depot or like jail, no. Like oh, jail. <laughs> You're right, like jail. It's like listen, why are you guys in orange? Because we are about to get a lifetime. <laughs> 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 the orange keeps coming up all the time. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. The orange, yes, from the jumpsuits yeah. a while ago and all that. That's true. Oh, orange yeah, that's true. for the night. You know what? Yeah. I, think, I think we're destined. Yes, that's right. right. For the orange, that's it. You got the handcuffs, the orange is coming. You're all set. <laughs> oh, God. Because <laughs> I, I feel we're predicting our future, babe. Oh. I love you guys' story, and uh, to tell you the truth, like we took you guys' bio, and I basically just changed. You wrote it in the first person. I just changed it to they or their, you know, put it in, and it felt. I, I, it was weird because the first thing you wrote is like we're a lesbian couple, and I struggled with that for about ten minutes. I'm like, if I write that, and it sounds like me writing him, and I gonna get a bunch of hate from everybody because I put that first, and I was struggling and struggling and struggling with it. If I should just put they're a couple. And I'm like, well, no, they put that in there, so I should leave it. But if anybody thinks that I wrote it, are they going to get mad at me for stressing the point? Well, I know. Yeah, that, I mean, I get where you're coming from, like, yeah. from your point of view. Like, are they going to attack you because you wrote it? Yes, exactly. Yeah. yeah like, oh, why, why should they, like, boom, like, write it specifically that? Yeah, I know. Like, people are like that. I mean. You know? And and that's what I was kind of struggling. Not that I, you know what I mean. Like it's not that I have a problem. I'm just wondering the way I worded. And I was like deleting it and adding it, deleting it and adding it. And I'm like, you know what? They put it in. I'm leaving it in. But as soon as I hit the the publish button, I kind of sat there for about 15 minutes. Like, should I edit it? Should I, should I yeah, edit yeah. It right now? No, I was waiting for the first comment to come in, giving me like a load of crap for it or something. <laughs> <laughs> but the, but have you received anything from it? No, I didn't. I was glad oh, to see oh, that. Look great. at that. That's it was like a bit of a woof feeling when I went to turn when I because uh, I always disable them when we go on live, oh, and I looked one more time like, oh, okay, we didn't. Nothing happened, so we're good. So yeah. Well, that's good. At least your your fear did not come true. <laughs> yeah. No. Exactly. No, but you know, sometimes you never know with people. Like you know, and that's the hard yeah. part today. Nobody wants to step on anybody's feet. Nobody wants yeah. to say anything. You yeah, know, so you're true. always. It's too bad because it takes up the spontaneity of it sometimes, you know, of a good thing. It's like a couple, and it should be like a, you know, a it's too bad that's thought into it. It should just be another thing, a saying a couple or a heterosexual couple, a lesbian couple, a gay couple. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, it should just be, it should be identified. Right? No, it exactly. Yeah. Or if it is not made a big thing about it, it's just a normal thing. It's just, yeah, yeah, like a normal thing, exactly. Yeah. It should be, but you know, like there's people around. Love is love. Yeah, well, that's what I was thinking. I was thinking about that when we were talking about the Home Depot wedding thing. 
you know, you could go to Home Depot and say, oh, my God, we have this couple and they met and, you know, they're this, you know, in Home Depot and they're getting married. They'd be like, oh, yeah, interesting. But if we said, oh, we got this couple and they're, they're a lesbian couple, and they're getting married, like all their they would be on top of it. They'd probably pay you guys a ton of money just that so they, is, you know, right now, true. That to make themselves look good. Not for you guys' benefit, but the PR campaign of Home Depot would be like banking in on it, you know? Exactly. Yeah, it's an advantage as well. Yeah, so you never know. You guys can become spokesmen. You can make a ton of cash off of this. You know? <laughs> so let's do it, baby. Let's do it. Let's do it. Wow. I'm about to I'm about to start speaking Spanish in here because I think it's like a lot. Do you find that uh, um, in in the recent years uh, the people's um, you know thoughts have changed or the attitude? <laughs> I'm sorry. Can you ask again? Because she's like choking. She's dying. Baby. Oh, is she okay? Is she okay? Oh, listen, <laughs> you want me to like? Oh, I can't. I'm I'm, I'm arrested. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. <laughs> On the live, we got witnesses and everything. <laughs> I'm like, uh, can't say you didn't do it. So you might have a lot of views. I'm like, are you alone out there? I just pictured like, the ambulance <laughs> coming and her in the stretcher, you walking behind with the cops. Like, is, there, is, there is there an extra bed? Because I need to lay down too. <laughs> Really no. Okay, back to the question. Back to the question, because she she asked something, but no, that's I said. Listen, but you are dying. No, all right, yes. I don't want anybody to die. As much as it would be a clickbait. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. Yeah, I'm breathing. I'm breathing. I'm reading the chat now. I'm breathing. I promise. Uh, talking about identification, I wonder if you have noticed in the recent years a change in uh, society or people around you uh, towards that. I mean, in like in the new, like if we base like on the news and what we see on TV and whatever, yes, it has changed a lot. Um, in regards to like our surroundings, I've never had a problem. Like my job is really diverse, it's really open. My family is really open and supportive. Her family is really open and supportive. So we never had like that hatred around mm -hmm. us. Thankfully, or thankfully. Yeah, exactly. yes, for sure. Um, so our surrounding has never been bad. So thank, thank God for that. Yeah. And um, but like society wise, yes, it has changed. It, like it has been real open like nowadays. Yes, there are countries where they're still against it and whatever. Um, but yes, it has changed a lot. And they're really supportive. They're trying to like, you know, like the bathrooms are inclusive in this, and mm. so it has Not changed a lot during the years. Out. What? I said now everybody agrees with that though, like the inclusive bathroom thing. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, now now. <laughs> They're like, excuse me, I'm gonna go in there with what? Because <laughs> <laughs> you don't know who's gonna walk into the bathroom because anybody can kind of walk into the bathroom, exactly. Which is yeah. like, scary in a way because there's so many bad people out there. Of course, so you don't know what their intentions are. Yes, so I get that point of view when people are like, oh hell no. Yeah. So yeah. <laughs> but I mean, in general, day to day though, I mean, things are getting they're not perfect yet, and then and some like some famous provinces here, some are better than others, you know, in the general. But this comes down, I think, in all in all, it's making. Le uh, steps forward at least oh yes well for sure yes yeah, yeah especially in uh in, in new york it's very diverse i yeah. think it's always been it's, i won't say yeah well for the most part because i've been born and raised here it's right. always been um the lgbt community has always been accepted in new york but i feel like yes. it's more open now these days right like a bunch of people like when we have next month coming up june um is pride month and yep. you will see almost everyone, even the people that are not involved in the lgbt community they still go out and support anyway you don't see as many like hate crimes happening, right? Mm -hmm. Montreal's come like Montreal's like that too. I mean, Montreal's a very very liberal city. It's always been it's well. I mean, it's not European influence, so it's always been like probably at the gateway to a lot of this stuff for a long time. And they have a huge Pride festival. And I mean, it's not just the LGBT community that goes. It's it's a city parade, not a yeah. You know, not a group parade. <clears throat> it's Everybody's part of the there. city. Um, yeah. You know, three three hundred sixty five days. Yeah, year. exactly. It's part of the city, so it's oh, so I, yeah. That's good. I mean, I love Pride here. I'm like kind of sad that I can I might not come to Pride, and I'm sad. Yeah. But you have Pride in all that, don't you? Yeah, but it's not the same. It's not the same in no, New, New York. York. New York, I don't. I don't know if anybody watching is even like aware of I mean, LGBT. Remember, involved, like every like New like New York is all, the best Pride 
place for you for pride New York yeah i mean like all the all the all the fight against all that um homophobia and everything started as uh, stone stonewall, stonewall. And yeah it's here in new york so right that's why they they do like the big parade where they um even like televise it and everything yeah it was right. televised last year for the first time ever really yeah, yeah last year was the first time they finally televised the um the gay parade huh I thought, yeah, I figured that was going for a while. Yeah, and last yeah, year, our yeah. prime minister uh, was actually yeah. he heading the uh, Toronto Pride Parade. Uh, Justin Trudeau, our new prime minister uh, for Canada, uh, he uh, he was the leader for the, the for the Pride Parade last year. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Look yeah. at that. Yeah. <laughs> now that's a difference right there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so somebody asked us, that's like, right. Frank. Oh, Frank. Yeah. Well, hi, Frank, first of all. <laughs> oh, the, oh, he has, like, what Spanish accent? Oh, where are we from? Because he likes the Spanish accent. Oh, I, I bet that's hers because I have no Spanish accent at all. <laughs> I have the New York accent. <laughs> I, was born in, I was born and raised in Puerto Rico, so I actually moved to New York when I was um 20. Oh. And then I lived in New York for four years, and then I moved to Florida one year, so... So i Yeah, so I'm Puerto Rican, basically. Have, have you been back to Puerto Rico since you left? Oh, um, well, when I was living here, I came like three times. I haven't been there in like two years. Okay. Because my yeah. parents are the ones that come and visit. Well, in Florida. Okay. Yeah. Well, yeah, Puerto Rico to Florida is not a very long trip. So, yeah, they're nice. They're pretty close. And that's Yeah. Cool. Yeah, exactly. But, yes, I'm Puerto Rican. And she's. I'm Puerto Rican. I was born and raised in New York. But my mom was born in Puerto Rico. And my dad was born in the Dominican Oh, cool! Oh, very nice. I love New. I love New York, by the way. Huh? I love New York. I haven't been there in like years, but or ten years now. I love New York, though. Yeah. New York is awesome. I, I love New York as well. She's waiting to go to New York. We I haven't taken her yet, so. Well, you need to step it up and take her. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. And it's like a couple hours from here. It's not like. You know, if we would be in Latvia and I would be saying it would be a different story, but we're right here. So. Yeah, it's about a five and a half hour drive from Montreal. <clears throat> and we love to travel. Look so how I, close you look are. Look at how close and she yeah. is. Oh, no, no, no. You got to step it up. We go, we're going to have to attack you on this one, Andrew. I'm sorry. <laughs> try. Hey, I'm sorry. Right. commenting on this life. Please tell. Can you please take tell her to Andrew. New York like, Andrew, now. Take her, now. take her to New York. Let him know well, as soon as possible. It's only a well, half an hour drive. <laughs> well, ladies, it's been a pleasure tonight. <laughs> <laughs> if, if you have been watching from the beginning, please let's count how many times he has said that to us. <laughs> and we're still here. <laughs> I don't think we're over it yet either. I don't think something tells me I'll be saying it again. <laughs> oh my goodness. No, we had a lot when of he, when he actually got on this call, the call we we're like, are we for, are we for real? Or, or like we're just kidding again. <laughs> We had a lot of trouble at the border with Xenia's passport before. Uh, it was kind of a gray okay. area because she was applying to be permanent resident. Okay. So, that was a while ago. Yeah, now she's a now she's a full fledged Canadian citizen since last year. So now she's yeah. Hey, see, see, now you can take now her. Now you can take her. Please yeah, her. we're good. So now we can go. Yeah. So. Now, now they're gonna ask you every time they come in. Yeah. You know. Are you coming yet? Are yeah. you coming yet? Exactly. So are you coming? Are you coming? So are you coming? Yeah. All I'm saying is that when you're coming, definitely you know, let me know. Hopefully she'll be around that time or we can all like meet up, collab or something. Yeah. Oh, it's so great. Hey, like sitting together or something. That's a plan. Yeah. Definitely. So, that's, so I love it. We're going to do we gotta do a handcuff challenge. Here you come. <laughs> <laughs> it's a, a pleasure <laughs> seeing you ladies and gentlemen. You said, I knew that. <laughs> there, we made it almost 60 seconds. <laughs> Coming? No, we're trying to convince him to bring his wife. We'd also like to meet a uh, Smoke oh. and a Grill and AB when we're there too, that channel as well. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we don't know who they are. Who's that? Oh, you never seen them? No. They do this awesome live streams, uh, smoking and grilling AB. It's amazing. Barbecue, and he does the cooking stuff right in the kitchen. I was going to say, is it about food? Because food is everything. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he makes gigantic hamburgers oh, like that big. Oh, they're so yeah. good. Like, I want to eat them. Oh, have to find them. <laughs> so good. You got to we're all going to collab. You're going to come. We're all going to collab at his house. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that food is live, so I'm down. Yeah. We need to collab. That that collab is important. <laughs> That's right. Anything with food, I'm willing to go out on a limb for. Oh, yes. Our stomach is going to say thank you. <laughs> thank you for the support. 
<laughs> oh, that sounds so amazing. I'm so hungry right now yeah, thinking about I know, those burgers. I know, I know. They just, look so I gotta good. shut my mouth. They look so <laughs> good. <laughs> okay, I'm a little hungry right now, so we're gonna go at the 24 hour diner right now. That's yeah. right. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go together. We'll go wife, we'll go uh, 4G and we'll go eat at separate places and talk at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> and if, same for you guys. If you ever get to Montreal, it's not that far away. You guys want to go another place besides traveling oh, between. Oh, oh, so this is, this is the situation. I need a passport. <laughs> She's the one that doesn't have a passport. I keep insisting. Oh, yes. And oh, because we both love to travel. I love to travel. I've been to Mexico and things like that. She wants to go to Mexico and other places, India, all these places. And I'm like, so can you get your passport? We can go. <laughs> yeah, like my main place, my, the main places that I want to go, I want to go to the R because it was so close to Puerto Rico and I never went. Um, right. So I want to go to the R, I want to go to so um, Cuba and I want to go to Panama. We can move So I want to go to those three places. Like there are, those are my main places and the bucket list. Okay. Um, but I need a passport for all three. <laughs> so. Well, then you got to go get your passport. Here, I'm going to put you on right here. Hold on, hold on. We're going to have a chat, you and I, for a second. Get your passport now. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> I've been talking about that for the longest, so hopefully that works. Did you hear him? I'm just saying. I've right. been preaching to anybody who doesn't have one, get your passport. Because what happens if you ever want a trip, like a giveaway or something, and no, you couldn't even go. Your okay. passport? And what happens if you get I'm going to leave her. I'm going to go by myself. Excuse me? You're going to stay. You gotta get that away back. No, I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna go by myself and send you a postcard and say you should have been oh, here yeah, with your passport. Oh yeah, okay. I don't want that postcard too. <laughs> This is what we uh, we were talking when you were talking about traveling. Everybody's pretty much seen this one already. But this is our wedding day. We got married in Iceland. Oh uh, wow! Is that oh, why you're wow. looking at the computer? Yeah. Computer. Oh. This is wedding picture. Wow. That's that's, nice. And that's, that's so nice. it's very different from a traditional wedding, yeah. which I love. Yes. It was a fjord outside of Reykjavik, about 40 kilometers away, and it was called Whale Bay. And that's a 700-year-old Viking site that we got married on. Wow. Wow. That. And there's a TV oh, that's show. That's a story. There's a and TV then, like, show. Is that a, like, a, like a robe that you have? We had a custom made. There's a TV show called Vikings. Oh, oh I, I, was was a, I was about to say, you look like a dead eye. Yeah, that was from the TV show Vikings. We had it recreated. We brought down like screenshots and they made it. Oh yeah. my God, I love it. Yeah. And then That's we, nice. we, so uh, we got married in Iceland because it's right in the middle. That's where the plates between North America and Europe meet. And there's actually, because she's from Europe, I'm from North America. So we met in the, we in married the middle. In the middle. Middle. That was, that's awesome. That was like perfect right there. Yeah, Look at that. And I didn't want to get married again. And she said, "Did you always want to go to Iceland?" And I said, "Yes." She said, "Let's get married there." So she tricked me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she tri oh no! They blame me. He here. proposed to me before with a yes, tin, I with did. a tin foil. Uh, oh, ring. Oh, see, so then don't lie. Oh, say, don't lie. You know, he didn't want to. He didn't want to get married again. It. You deserve it. But he proposed. <laughs> yeah, he did. But that was like a longer <laughs> while ago. And then, like I think, a couple of years later, I figured, well, I, I think it's time. Let's go to Iceland. <laughs> so it kind of was a double proposal there. Yeah. <laughs> It's like, listen, so, so, so when is it? <laughs> so I've, been, I've been waiting for so long, so when is it? Tomorrow? Oh, okay, let's go. <laughs> 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 well, yeah, we kind of. I think we talked about that in January or February or yep. something like February. I think it was, and and then got married in July. Yeah, so we had to find oh, the God. priestess. The priesthood uh, actually was married a, a gay couple. No, it was a husband, wife, and then a gay couple. Mm -hmm. The two of them, and we seen her, but we didn't know who she was. So finally, yeah. after two months, we tracked down the photographer in Chicago, who put us in contact with the bride and groom in Colorado. We then got us to Iceland to the priestess, and from there we just started building it up. Well then, whole, yeah. that was a whole procedure. Yeah, yeah, yeah it, oh, was. Yeah, it, it was. was. We yeah. almost had to go with no priestess book. Yeah, yeah, but it was quite cool okay. because it was just uh, two of us: photographer and his wife, and a priestess. That's all. We like left the kids else. at home, and just I didn't. I didn't us. want another big wedding. Yeah. And Xenia, her mom had died the year before, and she was an only child, and. So we kind of looked at all those things and why have a big wedding and be lopsided and all the money into it? Let's just do something for us. Yeah. So that's why we left and we went to Iceland and then we went to Sweden, then Latvia, then we did Norway and Denmark and then Iceland again and wow. just around the country. And yeah, you, got to, you, got did it for, you did it for your, both of your personal reasons and you yep. did it for the right way for you two and not for anyone else. Which is 100%. You know. And I don't regret a second of it. My first marriage, yes, I ended a divorce, but I mean, I still see a big wedding doesn't bring you happiness and you spend all your time planning for everybody else to be happy that day except for you. Just stressing out and everything. Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> Unless we get the job to someone else. <laughs> No, but just, you know it, what? so I we already did the work. I already proposed. That's it. So that's <laughs> right. So the next step is on you. <laughs> like, you already did what we had to do. So. You plan everything. We just so you plan everything. We, we, just, we just like also oh, when we it, oh it's tomorrow. Okay, I'll be there tomorrow. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. <laughs> but in seriousness, have you talked? Have you talked or have you thought about how it would be? Oh yes. A lot. <laughs> yeah. That's it. We're talking about everything already. Yeah. Like. So basically, I, I'm always like teasing her because I know how am I going to propose. But like, of course, it's not now. But I always tell like, I already know. And I, I have even dreamed about it. And she's like, well, how? Tell me. I'm like, how am I going like, to How is she going to keep doing that to me? Like, oh, my God, but I know how. And then I have this whole thing. And of course, anyone's going to be like, so can you tell me something? Because I want to know, too. But that's the point. But then you're like enticing me because I want to know. It's but that's exciting. the point. But I'm not gonna tell you. <laughs> <laughs> she just wants to tease me. You see the tease? Like, why tell me? Just don't. Uh. Just keep it to yourself. Uh, now, as a guy, I always had a life. She was said to me, "Like, mm, okay, tell me when you're ready." <laughs> <laughs> and even then, I don't know if I want to know. <laughs> yeah, well, us is a whole conversation from last names to everything. So it's like, yeah, I, a yeah. lot of. Lot of decisions, I know. but have you planned moment. like the wedding itself? Like, have you thought about what you want yeah. in it? Like, the wedding itself. Well, we want us, I mean, <laughs> if you have not, if you can't tell, we joke through, we love to joke and laugh. Oh my god, that's us. But <laughs> we definitely want us and the kids. <laughs> You're a whole mess. I know what you mean. I'm sorry, <laughs> he cracking up. Oh man! No, no, no! no but, okay, yeah. Well, you did ask me before, like if I want a big one or a small one. Yeah. And I said she wants a big one. I want a big one. Oh, a big one? <laughs> yeah. yeah. And I say big because well, is your family as big as mine? Yeah, my family is big. So as we big have one. two big families. Yeah. So that kind of makes sense to kind of have a big one. I wouldn't want to invite like a handful and then not include the rest when they are. In right. The so. No, if it's you're gonna eventually turn family. into a big wedding just because of the amount of people. Yep. And um, well, yeah. So that's yeah. why I want a big wedding. <laughs> but you need that kind of like you say, if you're gonna start inviting family, then it opens a whole yeah. Pandora's box because you then somebody's gonna be offended if you don't. I understand. Exactly. That. Exactly. exactly. Yeah, it's not gonna be. I don't. I personally don't want it to be like intimate. Just me, her, and the kids and the witness. I want like people involved and in, right. You know, so yeah, that's it's a big cool. celebration yeah. of the event. That's cool too. I love yeah. that. Yep, yeah. and that's the thing about weddings is kind of, especially today, I like that that it is has a more individual. Uh, people are allowed to think outside of the box. Before that was kind of a mandatory thing, and there's nothing wrong with that's what I meant. Like it just now, it's nice. There's more options available. Yeah, with all the. Years ago, you couldn't do it because there was family guilting each other. Oh my God! If you don't yeah. invite everybody, your marriage is gonna be ruined in a year. Or... <laughs> exactly. And there's still, and don't get me wrong, there's still like you know sometimes you know family members that yeah. like got a little more distant. You know, like they talk, but it is what it is. It's always there's always like not all the family. You know, it's like always like you know. Oh my God! Yes, I'm super supportive. Well, my my, my father's mother passed away when he was young, and just to show you how much things have changed. In 1965, when my parents got married, certain relatives wouldn't go to my parents' wedding because they considered it a mixed marriage because my father was Catholic and my mother was Protestant. Oh, my God. Like, can you imagine? Like, this is not like 150 years ago or anything, but it just shows you how much things have changed. How much like, things have changed, yes. Yeah, they're both Christian, just different. You know, I'm not saying one religion, but I'm just saying, like, even if you're tied up as can be, they're still both Christian groups. But even that was considered a mixed and marriage. And oh my God, your mother would be so ashamed if she was here today. Like some of his relatives did tell him that for marrying a Protestant. Which is kind of, which is kind of, it's kind of insane, right? It is. Uh, it like is. really? Like is, is it going to bother you as a family member? Yeah. Like, like it's us. This is our family. Why? Yeah, exactly. You know, it's it's things. So things, I guess, if there are signs it feels like we're going nowhere. But I guess in that sense, I guess we have progressed some, hopefully. Yeah, I mean some some things uh that we talk about our wedding that is different um that is different from I I guess like an heterosexual mm -hmm. um it's um the the last names who's gonna carry whose last name right and you can also choose like not to change it right 
but we have decided that we are but who's gonna change it That's so we were we were we were actually like joking was it last night was it yesterday just today it was today <laughs> this morning that we were like oh so we're gonna end up doing rock paper scissors the best of oh. course you gotta change the last name because <laughs> because <laughs> we're something like oh but i want to keep up but i want to keep it too okay so rock paper scissors and really <laughs> like, we want to change names but we also both agree that we want like she wants me to take hers but i'm like i want you to take mine so, so it's like, know that we haven't agreed you? on that yet. But. Yeah, so that's one. The other one is like, so who's going to walk down the aisle and who's going to wait at the end? Like, who's going right. to go down first? Yeah. Or are we going to yeah. like walk both of or are we going to both want to walk? Um, What was the other one? It was the last name. It was that one. That was it. No, there was a, there was a third one. That, that's the only one I remember. Oh, and um, me, as I was born and raised in Puerto Rico, I have. Both last, I have both of my last names, my mom's and my dad's. Oh, really? I only have one. So, so I was like, okay, so if we have a kid, Why then are we only gonna have one right. last name, or are we gonna have both of our last names and the baby, like the baby's both last names? So oh. that's that's another thing, like that is different. Yeah, it's so quite a decision, though. Yeah, <laughs> wow. Yeah. It's like it's like decisions that are like automatic, but like kind of automatic in a like, yeah. sexual relationship you know so yeah. when the guy is the one that waits okay the the girl takes his last name so that thing so it's the like guy's the one that and yeah 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 no so these are details that we discuss okay so we have a baby are we gonna have only one last name on on the baby or both i love <laughs> you're annoying <laughs> oh jeez <laughs> No, so extra. <laughs> oh my god. You you guys are right. <laughs> She's like, okay, you stop tapping on the table. I'm like, what? What? <laughs> Annoying. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> It's nice that you guys talk about this stuff because it is, and I mean I find it so interesting. I mean, yeah, it, it the way I was curious how you guys come to decide some of these things it's really it well see now we we were here to enlighten you and well, no but it's, it, it is interesting yeah. you know it's not uh i always think of uh, if you ever watch seinfeld george costanza when his girl uh, at the time uh, he's going out with that girl and then eventually she uh becomes uh she's dating a woman and george asked her when you dance like who leads i'll never forget that oh. you know the awkward heterosexual guy trying to make conversation so anytime i think of that now i think of george costanza right away <laughs> <laughs> worst question that ever come out in history so <laughs> that is one of the most one of the most common topic asked questions so is who, it who does this and it's like well we both do i don't know like this no are you serious though like it is like asked you guys a lot no that's a specific question though no I have that no i said in general like it's a it's a common commonly asked question like in the community in general yeah commonly asked questions is like so who's the guy Oh, yeah. So, who's done with dumb in it? So, oh. who does this and who does that? And we're like, uh, there was no guy. That's the whole point. That's the whole point. Two women, no guys. Thank you. <laughs> so, like, Sorry to you burst your bubble. Even, even if we, like, just, we, like, we switch our style of clothing or something, it doesn't mean that we're turning into a man. No, we're still women. No. <laughs> Like you said, the whole point, the whole point of it is there's no male equation. Oh, there we go. Oh <laughs> sorry, guys, sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry. He's really trying to freak us out, and eh? she wants us to think we're losing it. <laughs> Boy, we're slapping you on the table several times. <laughs> you guys are so. Oh my god, oh my god. Like in Quebec here, in the province of Quebec, you're not the woman is not allowed to take the man's name. Yeah, and I want to, but they don't have any choice. Oh, so and back in Puerto Rico, you keep your last name too. Like, there's it's not an option to change last name. So you marry oh, in Puerto yeah. Rico and you keep your last name. So oh, that's really? why that's why I have my two last names, my father and my mother's, because once you get married, it's still still the same. Oh well, I didn't know that. Yeah. Yeah, because here, like, if you got married, say, like in Ontario, where you're allowed to choose, and say we did. If we came to Quebec after that, they'll let her keep it. But because we got married, like living in the province of Quebec, they won't allow it. So, yeah. like in like in case of like kids, is both last names as well because of that? No, nope. because no, nope. uh, the kids have my you last can, yeah. name. Yeah, yeah. Oh. I mean, you can choose, but 
Because oh. the whole point is here that uh, women shouldn't be oppressed and that's why shouldn't be forced taking their husband or partner's last name. But then my uh, answer- I mean, I understand, but isn't it an option? Because- Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, to me, it's, it's more patronizing to women. Like, oh, you can't make up the choice for yeah, yourself. I want to have an option. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. exactly. Yeah. I want to have- You're supposed to have, you supposed to have the option. Oh, they always ask you. But, um, like here in the United States, they ask you when you get married, like, do you want to keep your last name or you don't? Yeah. And yeah. Then yeah. you decide from there. See, here it goes by province to province. Each province has their own, like province equal to states. They each have their own rules depending where you are. Because I want a fam. It's a family name, you know. Kids have it. You have it. You know. It's a family yeah. name. I yeah, it's like it's like Merry Christmas from da 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 family, right? Yes, exactly. Yeah. You know. But, but when you can, it's like Merry Christmas from da 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 family. But everybody's last name like this. <laughs> <laughs> she pretty much summed it up. Yeah, so yeah, true. You know, it's just to me that's the one thing about Quebec because it tried. Quebec is very, very, very like okay in Canada. In short, even our conservative party would be kind of equal to the to the uh, Democrat in the state. So here is extremely PC. And sometimes PC goes too far. Right so it makes all these rules. Mm -hmm. It takes away any choice from anybody. Yes, definitely. You know that's. It's, it goes too, like the pendulum swings too far the other way almost sometimes. I'll put that in back in. Mm -hmm. what? You yeah. know, it's too, too extreme of a feminism. I don't like the too extreme part of it because this type of feminism actually restricts me. So what exactly. kind of feminism it is, it is, you know? It's like, yes, you, you definitely feel oppressed. You're like, okay, so I don't have like a freedom of choice. Yep. Exactly. So it, it's quite the opposite of what feminism should be. So exactly. I, I don't... I, I get furious every time. Because it, it does. It. it kind of like takes out the equal equation and saying, well, women, yes. you know what? We, we're going to think for you. And I think that to me, that would be more offensive than saying you're equal, in my Definitely. opinion. Yes. You know? So, uh, so, what do you guys got planned for the summer? Lighten it up a little. <laughs> <laughs> for the summer? Well, damn. Like, you, well, we got to get married, get kids. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I smell engagement on the show tonight, guys. I see it. It's like, you know what? You want to marry me, like, right now? Because, like, apparently, no? Okay. I could officiate. <laughs> Let me go to marrying.com and get my license, and we'll be ready to go. <laughs> We're about, we about to get married on the live stream right, right now. now. Oh, my God. I always <laughs> said you should get that certificate. Oh, don't. Okay, I'm sorry I said it. I'm sorry I said it. Forget it. I think we have sparked a lot of conversations between you. For real, yeah. like, yeah. that's for sure. It's uh, like, oh, so thanks to you guys, we didn't sleep talking. <laughs> <laughs> we are talking after this life. <laughs> um, but plans to this summer. Well, her birthday, her birthday is in July. So oh, no. So we're planning to like do like a road trip somewhere. Yeah. We don't know yet. We just gonna drive and wherever the night goes, then we well, stay I'm gonna, there the I'm night. Gonna fly to Florida with her, and then we're gonna we're gonna drive. Trip yeah, we're gonna do our road trip, and wherever the night goes, then we stay there the night, and then we keep going. Cool. So, any just like uh, just the wind is your map. Wherever you end up is where you end up, and the yeah, I we want to go. We want to do a road trip, but we don't want any specific destination. It's kind of like leaving from Florida. Let's just see where we end up. It might be North Carolina, might be Georgia, might be South Carolina, because it's in that as long as it's on the East Coast kind of thing. Yeah, staying on the East Coast. Right. So, yeah. Yeah, well, at Seattle, you got to check out Seattle. Yes. Oh, Seattle, we're, we're planning going. to go in September. Oh, okay. That is so cool. Yeah, it's gonna be her. It's gonna be her birthday. For my birthday. Slash, um, house hunting. Yeah, house hunting. <laughs> oh, that's cool though. That's really cool. That, sorry, I was just trying to find the house. <laughs> well then. Like after Ashley's birthday, then we go. What do you? What do you like doing uh, when you are together? Like, where? What do you like doing when you're? Well, we record first of all because then we yeah. post. <laughs> that's the first thing that we do. We actually that that I think that's the most important plan that we actually make before we see each other because okay. it's long distance, so we have to have several videos so we can actually post until we see each other again. Right. So yeah, because if not, that. then it'll be, it'll, it'll be no interaction. No interaction for like, for like month months. Two months. And then it's kind of boring. We want to be able to upload at least exactly. once a week or something just to have something fresh on our channel. 
Right. That's so cool. we do that, and then after that, we just make plans like, oh, so this day we're going to do something with the kids, so we do it. This time it's just us, then we just go us. Yeah, we have an outing. It'll just be a vlog outing, whatever we're doing. Yeah. We just right. like, either go to the movies or, I don't know, we do a lot of stuff. Yeah. I like crazy stuff, so I like rock climbing and let's go do this go and cars. whatever. Go cars and Paintball. just do. I want skydiving, but like she's still, you know, I'm trying still to convince her to go, go skydiving. Yeah, it's fun. You should go. <laughs> <laughs> no, you went indoor skydiving. Sky 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 oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, so I, <laughs> I would love to try that. So yeah. I want to so bad, and she's like, hey, you know, no, no breathing like that. You can do it. <laughs> so she got an adventure like that. I, I rather. So I rather if I travel with something, I always look for excursions like that. And I'm like, okay, so if we can do something extreme, we're going. We're going there. We're going to do that. So I prefer that than that that as a first choice. And then we go to historic or like the museums and like stuff like that. Because I love like I love that as well. Because my degree is in art, so of course I love museums and all that stuff. Really. um, but I like to do extreme stuff first, and then okay, so let's get to the historical part, historical landmarks, and all that stuff. Even even on like to eat, I like like local places. I'm like, I oh, know not the tourist places, but let's go to the places like the hole in the wall and stuff like that. Right. Oh yeah, yes. that's, that's, like that's, that's, basically, that's basically what we do when we see each other. I already have like places planned. Like right now, there's like a place in Junkers, was it? Mm-hmm. Was like there's like a this big big slice of pizza i'm like okay so i want to go there or it's i see huge, i love like a huge, yeah it's like, it's like, it's oh, it's like a great big triangle i right? like it's like yeah, two it's feet long. one pie but it's one yeah. slice it's only yes. one slice so wow. i want so i want to go there i love ice cream so i always look for ice cream place i'm like all right so i want to go here now because i saw this place like random and google so i want to go so that's how we do that's how we plan we nice. go, all right let's go choose something random that not a lot of people go and then we go yeah wow what are the challenges um, then we've done our Q and A's. We done our first, uh, We did our first unboxing with the snack crate. Yeah. Which we have, yes. which we have um, the second one got to her house and she brought it today with her. So we're gonna do that. We'll probably post it tomorrow or Wednesday, one or the other. Mm-hmm. But we're gonna do the next snack box, the next snack crate. So, like we we try to, we try to plan things in advance, but then sometimes if it's a vlog, it's kind of like, well, we haven't had a video in a while. Let's just vlog what we're doing, even if it's random, and let's see what we can make out of it. Have you done, uh, uh, like, the videos from when you are apart? Like, uh, you know, making your own video where you are and putting them together, kind of? We only did we, one, we like did the weather, one. like the weather. We one. did one, and the caption was, we are living two different lives. And it was kind of showing the weather was extremely different. We had a whole snowstorm here in New York, blizzard. Yeah. And she just came out of nowhere with a little tank top, like, hey, guys. And I'm like, so I put, like, me while in Florida. And then she's just, like, there with her shades and in the Stunnyville. Oh, I'm stuck in a blizzard. I'm like, excuse me. <laughs> so we did only that because just to show like the extreme weather differences. But I don't yeah. think we've done anything like no. separate and then combined it. I've done two separate. Yeah, One I was making two my tips and I was telling people how we grew. I did some a tip video. And then I did a, a college vlog of mine in the beginning of our channel. I was going to do an ending because my semester just ended. And I was going to do like an ending vlog in school, but I never did it because finals kind of busted my brain. So I didn't get a chance to do that. So they so always try mostly do it uh, together. Like you're yeah, always, yeah. Like you stick it together, we always yeah. try to like stick it together. I mean, she has posted separate and I do record to post separate, but you know. And then she never posted. It. Yeah, I'm like, oh, so they so <laughs> did this today, whatever. So I'm doing this. I actually recorded it. So where is So where, where is it? <laughs> I'm like, ooh, well, the editing part, that's the part that I don't have time. <laughs> it's in my phone, though, it's and in I got my it. phone. Like, I can do a whole video, but the editing part. <laughs> editing and posting. Oops. Oh, my goodness. But, yeah. <laughs> well, question out of the blue. Uh, what do you like about each other? What is the top three uh, that you like the best about each other? Nothing. I'm, like, arrested here. <laughs> Who arrested? Who? God! <laughs> you arrested me. All oh, right, you arrested me. I just said I don't like nothing about you. That is why you arrested me. Who put the handcuffs on? Who? Oh, okay. I'm gonna shut up. <laughs> All right. So, um, for real, for real. I think like the best thing I love about her 
Well, well if, if we're gonna become cheesy and romantic, well, I love her smile. <laughs> uh, but the like to do, like she's really spontaneous, and she always got surprises and a lot of surprises, and and yeah, and she's always down with everything. I'm like, oh, so I actually want to go to this place, you know? To all right, so we going. <laughs> so I love that. Like, th- there's never a discussion to places to go and whatever. There's never a discussion to no, I don't want to go or whatever. I don't agree with everything. I'm yeah, it's like, scary. oh, I'm down, and then like I'm down too. Like, if she wants to go somewhere, okay, so let's go. So that's the the best thing, like spontaneity that she has, and uh-huh. just like the surprises. Like, uh, like the last time I came, I was coming here for ten days in November, and she actually had me the surprise. Oh no, we're going to Vegas the next day. Oh, <laughs> so yeah, and then that happened. <laughs> but it's all about laughing. I'm like, yes. Sorry, oh, guys. Yeah. That was a little something that I was doing. Hidden secrets. Sorry. Hidden secrets. Don't talk about them. Hidden secrets. No, but I have people. <laughs> Oh, whatever so yeah so that happened so like yeah like the surprises that she has and everything so i love that about her so now it's your turn but bet, bet she has nothing to say i just filmed by myself when we went to the cosplay in the book one time at school garden thing you just said that you did that. yes you did three times you know what i ain't talking to you no more uh, <laughs> okay, <then. laughs> you know what it's it's time to to get this out <laughs> yeah <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> I don't <laughs> no, I'm kidding. What do you like about me? Three things that I like about you. Hmm. No, I'm kidding. So I love I love that she wears her heart on her sleeve. Oh god. Hmm? I'ma just hide. She is very <laughs> 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 I love that she wears her heart on her sleeve. She's very caring. Mm. Like beyond caring. I don't even know if there's a word beyond caring. Is there another word? I don't know. Whatever. Um Mm. I definitely, I def- one physical thing that I love about her is I love her smile. Like she smiles and I smile, and I'm like, all right, that smile though. She just want to copy me. You guys don't understand. No, no. Shut up. <laughs> we always bother each other about that because we both always with the whole smile thing. But anyway, I do love her smile. And one, the third thing. I don't know, it's not a thing though. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm, I'm, I was, I'm boring. <laughs> <laughs> no, I got you in travel. I- yeah. <laughs> Are you guys ready to say goodnight to us now? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, still not coming to spot. Thank you. <laughs> I'm gonna block the camera. Now. It's so it's a pleasure to meet you guys. That we got something. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are amazing. Um, I know. I love so many things. Like, how am I supposed to pinpoint one? Just choose one. Yeah. I picked two already. Yeah, it's hard sometimes when you do though. When you, I think uh, for me too, sometimes when it's uh, you love somebody so much that it's just a whole personality, the whole, the yeah, everything whole of the person. Sorry, <laughs> uh, <laughs> she scratches me with her nails. It's like, it's like, it's a me abuse, hold on. But what you fall in love with, and it's hard to distinguish something separately from the person when you exactly. love. That's why I'm like, okay, it's so many. How the hell are like you? <laughs> God. She said, I said, like, who I asked her. <laughs> oh my God. Talking about you. 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 You are the wholesome personality. Wholesome. <laughs> <laughs> There's something I don't get put in my name every day. <laughs> Kind of the antichrist of wholesome, but sure. No, the whole, the whole different personalities that you got I guess right if I could pinpoint one more thing, it definitely would be the sense of humor that I love. Like, we can, like, I don't know if you guys can already tell just from now, but we legit are like this all the time. Oh, we I figured that. Constant, we are laughing constantly. Oh, I love that. Yeah. Each other. We're always roasting each other, too. Like, I make fun of her, she makes fun of me, but it's like playful, loving way. Yeah. Uh, no. Yeah. Like, we just connect really well and have so many things in common. When in the beginning, we actually thought we had nothing in common. Yeah. But we actually have a lot in common. A lot. Like a lot. So that's like when people come over when we get to know them, like especially our friends who bring new friends over and they see us joking. The guys are usually like this for the first 30 minutes. But for us, it's just second nature. All the time, like for real. Yeah. This is just another day in paradise, guys. Don't worry about it. <laughs> No, and then when you and the look that you get to each other, and then you understand each other just by looking, 
and oh, yeah. people start laughing and people just look at it well, why are they laughing though? oh yeah we, we have that a lot exactly it's great that yeah. Then he's great at bringing stuff up to me, like you know, really easy questions to answer. What's that song with the drums? And that's about as much as she'll give me to work with. And for some ungodly, terrifying reason, I can usually come up with the answer what she's talking about. <laughs> like, how? <laughs> like, how did they do that? <laughs> yeah. And then I usually take Tylenol and go lay down because I terrify myself and I don't. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god. We make our own fun. And Xenia, one thing I love about her is this one because being from Eastern Europe, there's something about when she gets tired, she starts trying to say expressions. And either they're like your Eastern European expressions that never translate to make any sense, or she just kind of comes up with her own ones on the fly. And I don't know which ones I enjoy more. Yeah, it's like my head feels like a bucket. Or, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or, or the weather yeah. is like hedgehog in yeah. the fog. When the typewriter hedgehog. flies north, always remember the polar bear dances, like something so far. <laughs> <Wow. laughs> and to her, it's just right on point. But me, I'm completely lost. I give that dog <laughs> when you're up one down. <laughs> you're like, Huh? Huh? Like, then he says I'm breaking his brain. So. <laughs> You're like, can you speak English, please? Again? Yeah. Oh, okay, I got it now. Now I can laugh with you. <laughs> but it keeps it fun. I wouldn't like. She's always said to me since we met. She always said, "I love you much." It was the translation thing, and that's the one thing I've always begged her never to stop saying because that always meant the most to me. Because that's the way she always said it from the beginning. So instead of I love you very much, it was always I love you much. So I was, uh, so I <laughs> asked her never to stop saying it that way. So I it's her you. accent. I love her accent. No, like, no, they say I love you much. So we say I love you impossibly much. Yeah. You say what? Sorry? We say I love, I love you, you impossibly, impossibly much. much. Oh, oh, I love that. That's, that's awesome. thing. That's nice. It's like, how can you? It, it started as a as, as a joke or something. Yeah. We were just talking. We we're like, oh, how can we express in words that I love you more than it's words like, can it's describe? Impossible to love you as yeah, I it's as so it's impossible. It's impossible to love you as much as I do. So impossibly much. That's I nice. love that. I love this. That's, 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 that's like how to be at your wedding it. somewhere in a plaque or yes. something like that. On yes. I actually tattooed it she on my body. Tattoo on her body of it. Oh really? Yeah, yeah. the tattoo. This is I love you possibly much, and she has the date of when we got together next to it. Oh, no. Nice. Wow. wow. That's dedication. Yeah. <laughs> That's off to you. <laughs> yeah, All right, bottle like, caps, get ready. It's like on her, her ribcage. It's on the side. I'm like, okay. I mean, what's it? Can't show. I know. So, actually, it's so 10, it's, but yeah, you're right. Hi, you so might. It's all this. And then it's wow. all the way at the end, and then the eleven twenty-two, which is when we got together. Wow. wow. What is what is it? Sorry, just, just, it's a lion. It's a lion. It's a lion. Oh. Wow. Oh, I see That's... that. That's amazing. Oh wow. my god. I thought you meant like something on the side of your ankle. <laughs> you thought it was something small, and then you just <laughs> Like the prize. <laughs> wow. That well, I don't know what to say. That's yeah, impressive. Like, like, wow. That, hmm. wow. <laughs> Wait, wow. Oh, <laughs> I like got is some Yankee girl on the side of my arm. I guess you went way further than I did. So <laughs> is it your only tattoo or do you have more? No, 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 I got more. I got this one right here, which um it says um remind me that we always have each other, and then my brother has when everyone else is gone. So it's a whole phrase. Wow, oh, that's cool. nice. And then I got the uh, then I got Avicii. Mm. It's the the DJ. I don't know. We don't know if you know him. He recently passed away. Yeah, yeah. he passed away recently. Oh, yeah. Okay. So yeah, so young. That's so unfortunate. That's that's yeah. very unfortunate. Yeah, I actually my tattoos always have to have like a really strong meaning. So right. I didn't tattoo. I I didn't do Avicii's tattoo just because. Um, they um he actually has a video um so wake me up, and um it's actually about to belong like you trying to find yourself and trying to find where you belong and trying to, like you feeling lost at the beginning and then you find yourself. So I'm like okay so I finally feel like I belong so that's okay. why I did it. So I didn't do it just because oh it's a DJ. Right. We did it because of the video. Mm. See, my, that's mine is, uh, well, I'm not trying to compare. I guess mine's a little more touching. I just got drunk for a couple of weeks and got three tattoos. <laughs> well, damn. Wow. It's that's a very sad story. 
that it, has not really it, meaning. <laughs> you might want to cry a bit, but I understand. I can take a moment here. So. Frank Frank said, "Wow, nice tattoo. I would have never guessed." Oh. No, that's it's so big. Like literally, I thought when you said that, you I said, thought, "Oh my gosh, you got a frame." Yeah, 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 like her ankle, you know, the little thing there. Yeah, like, it's beautiful. It's like I she holds that. up her shirt. Yeah, it's like it's not. Everything stuff. has meaning. Um, the lion is because it, it represents strength. It's okay. her favorite animal. It's my and I'm a Leo. It's her favorite animal. Oh. It's actually it's. It's actually geometrical because, like, my degree is art, so that's why I didn't want it like realistic. I wanted geometrical and um, watercolor because that's um, part of what I do. And then um, it has like a line, and the line represents my life. And then that's when it says impossibly much in the 1122, which is when we got together. So everything has a meaning. That is wow. amazing. Yeah. That's very cool. Like, I, what a I great love story that. Behind I, I it. love that. Yeah. No, that is. Yeah, no, my really seems stupid now. <laughs> Oftentimes you get the question, that's me on the hand. Yeah, yeah, a lot of people ask. I actually got Jim Morrison on my arm and oh, from the really? doors. Yeah. And then, yeah, it was... Oh, oh nice. wow. Nice. And oftentimes they say, oh, is that your wife on your <laughs> hand? And I don't know if to take it as a compliment or not. <laughs> I like it. I, those came out good. I yeah, used to I used to be a drummer. I actually had hair down to my waist. I was in a thrash metal band. I was that farm wow. boy that left the small town, got oh, to Montreal, wow. and I was a drummer. And this is from a Tama drum uh, magazine. I saved it for five years. That was my first tattoo. Oh, oh nice. wow! Oh, probably, nice. I can't tell. Yeah, I'm so blind. Yeah. <laughs> wow, that's nice. I like it. And then I got the girl on my side. This is and the girl. And then I got the. And then I got the girl. And, and, and I got this. I got it. And then I got the girl. <laughs> this one was the. This one was the piss off my mother. <laughs> it's like you know what? You don't want tattoos. Like do one here. <laughs> I got this one. Drank till on Thursday. I drank till Saturday and got this one done. And then wow. two weeks later, I got this one done. And wow. then I went. I sobered up for enough just to get away from it. So <laughs> you're like, I'm, I'm gonna get sober because I need to recover from all the blood. That I That's right. That That's right. Uh, th this one here, they didn't even want to give it to me because I was drunk. I had to pretend that I was sober because they don't want to, you know, you'll bleed. Yeah, the blood. Much. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, oh yeah, I haven't had anything. Being drunk and getting tattooed. Yeah. Oh my god, I would not be able to fake being drunk. Uh, they're gonna know I'm drunk. <laughs> don't worry, you don't even like. <laughs> Yeah, I don't have any tattoos at all. Really? Yeah, I don't have any. Same as Xenia. Yeah, I yeah, know. No. So our next tattoo, I'm, I'm going to design I'm it. So slate. she's actually waiting until I design it. Oh. It's been how many months? <laughs> a lot. A lot. <laughs> okay, so, so that's going to be her first tattoo. That's cool. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> so, yeah. Any I'm, ideas what you're going to do? Tell me with them. What? I'm not talking about with them. No, yeah, I know. But that's long enough. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I see an expose coming, guys. I, I'm, like, I'm like, oh, so I'm not supposed to do it. Okay, oh, so. <laughs> well, I did it. Oh, damn. I just, I just put oh. the spider. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, they're, they're bottle caps. Oh, thanks a lot. Only a Frenchman gets a tattoo of a man on his body. Jeez. <laughs> 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 bottle caps. Well, as I said, no Frenchman here, so I don't yeah, know who no. I'm, about. I'm a staunch Federalist, but nice try, though. Yeah. He likes trying to get me going. <laughs> bottle caps is something else. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Anytime, he... anytime bottle caps is in the chat, oh, my gosh. Like, yeah. always. Bottle, not... cap, bottle caps is that old crusty guy. Remember in the Muppets, the two old guys that sat in the balcony? That's bottle caps. <laughs> bottle caps. <laughs> Except he's older. Just to piss him off. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah. <laughs> Bottle caps is saying some stuff. He's always saying stuff. He's always got something to say. <laughs> I can't get up because I can't. I don't know what's happening. Oh. Huh? Stay tuned, folks. Stay tuned. <laughs> <laughs> to be continued with the, with the SpongeBob letters. <laughs> Oh my god! She's she's got the Pepsi bottle, so we're it's like a Pepsi commercial. We're waiting. Um, but why well, is like well, I mean, so while we're talking, um, so I'll put it to you. So yeah. 
You can you can leave it like that. No, I'm saying I put it to you. All right, so we gonna keep talking. I thought I got to leave because I'm handcuffed here, (laughs) (laughs) so I have to do my talking away from the screen, but I can't go anywhere. (laughs) Kind of stuck here. Oh god. Oh my god, Almighty! You guys are too much. (laughs) I'm glad we were able to. (laughs) Right? You guys crack me up. Oh, you fell off. Oh, there we go. Uh, 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 there we go. I'm sorry. I think it had been a couple of anyway. minutes. I was wondering. I was you're letting me down. I was waiting for that. <laughs> you're like, wow, I haven't fallen yet. <laughs> <laughs> I thought my clock was fast or something. <laughs> oh my god, oh my So how long you are, are staying now together till till you have to leave again? It's still Thursday. I leave on Thursday morning. Thursday oh. really in the morning at seven. Yeah, because she has to go back to work. She does the same face as you when she's upset with the lip out. I was just yeah, watching. he just told me pout. I just pouted. I yeah, yeah. yeah, I seen it a while ago. You did it. That's your second time. I caught the first time too. Well, thank God I didn't. I don't. I didn't get her because I don't like her when she does that. Oh, no. like, like being violent. <laughs> she just doesn't like to see me sad. So anytime I pout, she's like, "You better stop pouting." Oh my god. Stop does that too. Yeah. I know that. No. Oh, okay. But don't don't pop though. Think about it. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, we better let them go and yeah. and, and enjoy each other. Yes. Um, and not steal lo- lots more of your time. Uh, thank you so much for uh, agreeing to being on yeah. our live stream. I know uh, it's you know you have only so many hours together, and I'm very appreciate that you could. Thank you, so thank you, thank you guys for like for having, um, us. For having us. Yes. Oh, well, here I'm showing them this because I want them to come to Montreal. So this is the poutine you can eat when you're here. So what? That's the famous yeah. Montreal dish, poutine. It's curded uh, salt cheese melted on French fries with gravy. Oh my god! Wait a second. So when we go, in, <laughs> we both like foodies. So we're like, we're like oh. I know that, and there's smoked meat. So that's the two big things that are here. So. Oh wow! Not pastr- not go? pastrami, smoked meat. There is a difference. Oh, it's a difference. Oh. Okay, well, see, I thought yeah. was sorry. All right, so sold. We're going. <laughs> yeah, there you go. It well, would be so great you guys come up this weekend though, because, like, we need to go there to Montreal, but then, like, you have to bring her to New York. Yeah, yeah. so it's like, <laughs> you know. But just pardon me, while I have to do one thing before you go. Get your passport. <laughs> I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. I'm a, I'm a blogger. I'm like, I got my passport. I'm doing a video about it tonight. I'm doing a video <laughs> to get you get your passport. Oh my god, you guys ladies, it's been such a pleasure having you both, and and it's you're incredible people. Your videos are Thank amazing. You. Thank you. Love the family dynamic. Love how open and honest you guys yeah, are. Yeah, and always laughs. I, I, yeah, that's yeah. It was a good time. It's been, been, a, good, it's yeah. been a great time tonight. Yeah. <laughs> we'll have to do this again the sometime. And the chat had a good time with us because you know we're crazy. <laughs> oh, I think everybody really enjoyed themselves. Oh yes, so. they did. That's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. Well, thank you for having us. We appreciate it. Oh. I'm. A, I always say we love watching the channel because again, she doesn't watch YouTube. I do, but. <laughs> I enjoy watching your guys' channel. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna start watching. I'm gonna start watching the video because then you, you're roasting me here. And- <laughs> <laughs> I was like, you know what? I'm about to be more updated than you. Oh, you know what Andrew so, and them said? So do yesterday. you know, do you know what they posted? Oh my God! They said there's no but way. I haven't seen the video. Oh, you see? And then you tell me that. Well then. Okay. Your life kind of sounds like my life for some strange reason. <laughs> No, no, no way. <laughs> oh, we lost them again. No, no, no. It came camera tank off by low power mode. <gasps> oh. oh well, yeah. Guys, wait, thank wait. you so much for coming. Yeah, we're, we're coming back. Give us two two seconds. I don't know what happened. Can you still hear us? We yep. can hear you, yeah. Oh, okay. I'm like, well, can you still hear me? I guess because the, the battery got low, so it went into like low power mode. Yeah. I didn't know that was going to happen. Mm. Well, that's no problem. But like I say, well, you guys take care of yourselves. Please keep in touch, and we'll have to do this again. And we'll do it when you guys get to Montreal. And yes, when we get to New York, so we'll have two and collaborators. Yes. And when and I get my passport, and we're actually going to show you a special passport. <laughs> and for sure, 
uh, everybody, like you stay tuned. We're going to keep documenting our journey about yep. being long distance, about closing the distance, everything that we do as a family, as a couple, individual. We will continue updating everyone. Yep. So thank you, everyone, for tuning in. Thank I hope you. everyone had a great time. I appreciate you guys. And until next time. <laughs> thank you. Take Bye. care, guys. Have a great night. Good night. Enjoy your time. You Bye too. now. Bye. Oh, that was so much fun. They're so amazing. It's the first time we've talked like voice to voice, and they were even better than I thought they were going to be. Oh, you know? they're so fun. They're so much fun, well, and I uh, they're just easy to be around. They are. Um, they're so, you know, it's it's that's that's what is so great about that. Mm -hmm. It's just easy to hang out with, and would definitely would love to uh, when we go to New York to get in touch. We like all of our guests, and everything and this is just another one of these times that you think this is fun to do this yes you yeah know? definitely yeah art of morbid you're taking off you have a great night thank you so much for coming always a pleasure of you there was another amazing guest somebody i got to catch the last few minutes because i would have been very jealous i hadn't i've gotten to uh catch you at all so thank you so much and you take care um i promise today uh, yes, <laughs> mm. uh, I promised that I'm gonna uh, show Bottle Caps chicken. Oh, I, I put it on the li uh, live uh, live folder. Push a live folder, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, because uh, of course, uh, Bottle Caps was sending me a picture of his barbecue chicken, and I wanted to know what he put on it, and he wasn't gonna tell me unless um, we are sharing. So. <laughs> Bottle Caps is he just loves this. Why don't you show your face and come on? You love the spotlight. Why don't you just do it? It's probably gone somewhere again. For there, a minute. Yeah, there's his chicken. Yeah, so looks there's amazing. a bottle caps chicken. Uh, looks amazing. Like send send some over, please. Yep. Because I'm like literally dying here. I could go for that right now. Exactly. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's made with all of bottle caps tender love and nurturing. So now when bottle caps uh, caps comes back, please tell him yeah. to share his uh, what is on top of it because I really want to know what the rub is. Or, or he sauce. saves all of his. Oh, there he is. He just popped up. Oh, there oh, he you is go. Here. So, what is on top of your chicken? He puts all of his love and caring into the chicken. So, by the time he gets here, he's run out. That's when we get the bottle caps we know and love. Yes. Oh, by the way, I was telling Roxy Stars about the poutine, uh, the one yeah. with uh, chicken and. Uh, Peas and coleslaw. How is it called? Do you remember? Uh, uh, Galivo. Galli Galivo. Galivo? Yeah. Yeah, I it's think, the best. I don't eat it, but. It's, you like with beef cubes? Well, this, the one that I was telling you about, that's like really good. It's so good. And I mean, you, you're so full after, obviously. But it, I call it all dressed. But it's, it's really good. It's my favorite one. Go. You sent a picture of ingredients. Okay. This here one here you're talking about? Uh, the one that we have in Fergomay. Yeah, but okay, the one else we uh, Yeah. This, which one? Yeah. This one? Yeah, but I don't know if they have. I don't know if it's identical, there. but uh. Yeah, it's basically has cheese, coleslaw, peas, and chicken on it. It doesn't sound like it's good, but it's really good. You had some barbecue jerk rabbit yesterday. Mm. Who's that? Uh, Roxy Stars. Oh. Yeah. By the way, uh, Ian Boucher is in. Yes, Ian. Good to see you. It's been a little bit. I hope all is well. Yeah. Good uh, to have you here. Cat Shark Vids. Hello. Good evening. We just uh, said bye to our amazing guests tonight. Yes. Uh, definitely check them out if you still haven't. They're so much fun and they're together right now for a couple of days. That was so nice of them to share their time company. with. Yes. Uh, just send, putting the link to their YouTube. Check them out. You're old and ugly. Well, I don't know. Their ears are cute. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, Doodles. I know. I know. By the way, it was amazing live streams uh, yesterday. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no. It, it it's just so homey, yeah. so yeah. pleasant to hang around uh, everybody, you know, the family. And you drawing was really nice. Ingredients don't help. It's like taking pick up flour and sugar and saying here's a cake. Well, exactly. Uh, now I'm gonna go and check out the, the pictures. Why it's so complicated? Bottle caps. You sent me. So it's just chicken. I. Um, 
Oh, okay. You sent me a picture of ingredients. Ketchup. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, it's ketchup and what? Tzatziki? Is that what I'm seeing there? Really? Where did you get that? Oh, I, Doug, you did great. You did great. Don't worry about that. It was a really enjoyable to watch. Uh, um, I'm so jealous of your talent. <laughs> I can never say that enough. I love them. It's just such a pleasure to watch you drawing. Well, Caps, I can't see if that's Tzatziki or not. Oh, my God almighty. <laughs> no, because we used to buy these uh, um, homemade from... Uh, from the la ladies in the market, from old ladies, the same as they were uh, selling, you know, blueberries. They were mm -hmm. selling homemade tzatziki. They're a sweet chili Thai sauce, he said. Okay. Okay. Well, almost as good. Cool. Here is a picture I forgot to bring up a while ago when we were talking to them. Uh, let's see here. Screen share. There's our... Uh, uh, you image there's our prime minister walking in the in the pride parade parade last year excuse me but in montreal um it's a pretty big it's, I, I was trying to find out the numbers i know it's pretty big one of the bigger ones that one's kind of a sparse show of it what is steven saying le bouchon to walk to voir I'm not going to butcher French. Uh, I think that's right. The bouchon to viet et in lights. The butcher. Uh, Let me translate you. Yeah, the duvons throw me off. Oh, here's a good picture of pride. The caps must be on. <laughs> that's what Google says. <laughs> There you go. Uh, yes, bottle caps. I knew you'd make a comment as soon as you seen Justin Trudeau. I'm not a fan of his either, so you're not getting me going. Hello, Steph. Mm. Hello. So nice to see you. Mm. How are you doing? We don't live in Toronto. What an ignorant ring on bottle caps just said to you. It's unreal. I'm going to stop accepting your dinner pictures or sharing them. <laughs> you think you were bad at night shifts? Night sh shame shames. Stream? You're not helping your this, cause right now. This really wasn't good, actually, <laughs> at all. Even if it was supposed to be a joke. Um, okay, so Roxy stars. We live in Montreal. Yeah. Uh, so, no, uh, for that. Scrumptious model trains. Hey, Hello. how are you? Good to see you. Yes, how I've been doing. Actually, bottle caps, you remind me of Jean Chrétien. <laughs> I never thought of that before. Uh, let's let's get a look at Jean Chrétien. He's a former uh, uh, a prime minister here in Canada. I'll show you this sexy beast. Yeah, bottle caps kind of reminds me of him. Never thought of that. He he was a looker. One cat, one fish. What's up? You're eating fruit salad. It's organic yeah. and good. Farmer's market. Oh, that's yeah. cool. I've been eating fruits the last couple of days. <laughs> there's, there's bottle caps. Yeah, yours look kind of similar to what I seen yesterday. <laughs> Do you got the same beautiful smile? I'll leave this puppy up for another few seconds just so everybody can get a good glimpse. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, so tomorrow we're going to be having our uh, usual t uh, Tuesday Tech Talk. Um, mm -hmm. If you would like to ask any questions to us or in the chat, everybody have questions, everybody has answers. Anything about photo editing, video editing, social media. Possibly has answers. Uh, yeah. <laughs> anything that we or chat might help you with, just drop by and we'll chat. Uh, just hang out uh, tomorrow. And then uh, on Wednesday, uh, we are going to have Within Hiking Distance. Uh, they are really amazing. Uh, they are traveling really across a uh, uh, U.S. National, how is it, State Parks, it's called? Yeah. Yeah, U.S. State Parks. Um, really cool couple. I'm really looking forward to that. So yeah. that will be really amazing. And then the rest of the week, of course, more and more guests to come. Night, Roxy. 
have a great one. Thank you so much for coming. It's so nice to have you here. Many, many thanks. I love that one, one cast, one fish. That's really cool. There's, mm -hmm. there's some handles. I don't know. I give you guys such props for coming up with your channel names. You're going on long hang this weekend to prep for your July trip, Stephen Bauman. Oh, nice. wow. Cool. I hope catch a few more streams throughout the week. Yeah, yep. we're here every night uh, from Monday to Saturday at 8 p.m. Eastern. I will give... Usually it's a couple of times before somebody gets it, but I feel bad, and you seem like a great channel, so you get monitored. They have been before here. Yeah, yes. Oh, that's right. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so 8 p.m. Eastern, and just pop by, say hi, even if you can't stay for long. Exactly. Um, are there any suggestions to what you guys would like to talk about more tomorrow? Uh, if not, we'll just fly hmm. by with the questions. But uh, if you have anything in particular that we can uh, maybe look into beforehand, uh, don't be shy and ask See what we can do for tomorrow. Uh, you got back one. Got, oh, got you back. Good. Good. I'm glad you guys are mingling with each other. Excellent. Excellent. I have an interesting question for tomorrow's show. Okay, sure. Perfect. Or Shoot. maybe saving it for tomorrow. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're not going to answer <laughs> any. I thought maybe there's yeah. something that uh, we can look into more that it's, yeah. uh, involves something bigger, like a tutorial or something. Hey. Uh -huh. <laughs> Panic D. By the way, I don't know if you didn't see in the chat. Uh, uh, Panic D has a Christian minister certificate. Really? Yes. My God, you guys are interesting. I never know what's coming next for me. I mean, but... first of all, how did it never appear through our interview? Second mm. of all, that's some combination. Paranormal, yeah. educational, Christian minister. Like, put that on a business card. <laughs> That's some combination. Uh, mm. that, that's amazing, though. That's really amazing. <laughs> Found this little picture your favorite. No, no, come <laughs> on. No. This was the first time I took Xenia skidooing, and she kind of fell off. Panic D is looking for a way to stream an MP3 with an image. When the MP3 changes, the picture changes automatically. Can't find something. Oh, my God. I have no idea about that. Well, you're just going to stitch together. I don't understand that. Well, yeah, the one way you could do it is, is you do, but you'd have to pre-make the video and you make your yeah. MP3, you drag just, then you do it and drag the, yeah. the, the picture, the length of it, and then keep, but that's a lot of data. So you want to know how to synchronizing it? Yeah, well, either you may pre-make the video or, I don't know, the synchronizing part, I wouldn't know about that, though. Cards are not big enough for my resume. But the combination of, of paranormal Christian <laughs> minister is quite, it's unbelievable. I've never heard of it before. That's amazing. Yeah. That's uh, crazy. Oh, yeah. I'm talk so about sure. the best and worst parts of living in Canada. <laughs> Ball gaps said that it's a good question. Yeah. yeah, we should have ball caps on the bad parts. Um, <laughs> Without making a video. Okay, so you want separately synchronize. Well, then you need a program, I would assume, that can separately synchronize it. But like, is this for what? Like, the, like to do like a live stream? You're gonna be running for a while? Or I maybe I be IBS. OBS. OBS. Uh, is that what you're yeah. asking for? That's what I'm thinking, and then you're gonna need like some sort of like look through. Uh, like plugins for it. it's the only thing I could think of. I would search search synchronize MP3 with image. Mm. Put that on Google. Hi and bye. <laughs> uh, I'll check that out though too. So we'll see mm. what we come up. Um, well, bits of real panther. Have a good night too. Uh, Susie back. Uh, hello. It's we are just about to end our stream. I had a phone call. Well, the flight. First, my yeah. goodness, that's okay. Uh, oh, oh, BS. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Sorry. Oh, yeah, um, technically bro. challenged here. Mm -hmm. So, um, but look into it and just look, even looking for, I mean, people are doing it already probably. So just type in like, uh, yeah. 
type in uh, mp3 uh, obs packs even that you'll probably find some that pair together or ob uh, mp3 or music video packs there's got to be stuff already done for that <laughs> see uh, bomb caps is telling the truth i honestly thought he was there that night i, I really did we have several hundred mp3 recordings want to stream the showing a picture in the mp3 chains Picture changes so I, I found yeah. a video for you, Panic Dave, right away. How to synchronize music to your photos and videos. So you search, there's a whole bunch of stuff comes up, tutorials and yeah, and but for so. streaming on the, that might not work for it. That's is it for streaming? Because I didn't put see put streaming in the search. No, but then you just share it. Yeah, yeah, I could run it through the desktop, but I don't know. I, I think I know more. I think I see where he wants to go with it. Maybe. Yeah, I can run it as an open window. Oh, that sucks, Musky. I'm sorry to hear that. I'm mad. I spent most of a day fishing my creek film uh, fishing series and then missing files for like half of my footage. Yeah, that's not good. Been down that road before. <laughs> Bottle caps. I know. I know how it works, Susie. The other man is always the last to know. Jeez. Oh, he uh, he had a big official apology for to doodles uh, oh, in he? the stream. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Apparently, bottle caps wasn't aware either, so he uh, issued uh, an official deep, sincere apology to your husband on our chat earlier tonight. So, I shot some videos today, too, but was very unhappy with it. I have nothing as well. Thank you. Yeah, Susie. one cat, one cast, one fish. That happens some days. You go and you think you got gold, and you come home, and it's just like this sucks. This, but you know what? Keep your footage. Because that's what I do a lot of times, and you'll be amazed two, three down months down the road. Sometimes you'll find you can use parts of it. And I don't like getting rid of footage. We have, uh, well, we have eight hard drives running here through our little server, and uh, I'm always keeping them going in footage. Like I said, trains alone, I'm at a hundred and some gigs. Yeah, Panic, they just had the same issue with all of their stuff there lately. So that was pretty bad by the way Rezonia had a great idea you could add the photo to the file as the f album thumbnail What's and then it would yes. stick that's a actually yes a that's very a good idea. easy solution to yeah. that that's Thank a really you, good Buck. One. yeah very good that's very smart like they say now you're cooking with oil uh there and uh, he made another apologies, Doug. <laughs> no worries, no apologies needed with a laugh because he's not too worried about it. And then right underneath that, Miss Pusha is hot tonight. Who says that? Who else? <laughs> Who else? Are you serious? I asked on purpose. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Susie, by the way. Uh, that's right, Doodles B roll. <laughs> Well, dog, that should oh, that's in. yeah, that sucks, Muskie. I know that sucks. Yeah, I've had before when you think that you're recording and you haven't. Oh, that's, that's like sucks too. So I was on the button, and I noticed that at like weddings and stuff, I catch myself because I, I does say on my screen, but I'm not paying attention, and I tap, and not realize that I'm actually shutting it off when I think I'm starting, and vice versa. That's happened before. Panic D videos. Okay, we have packages to get together to ship out. Been lax in getting that done since we are addicted to Pusha Studios <laughs> live stream. So we're addicted to you so guys. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming. So appreciate it. Always a pleasure to have you here. What was good? Mm. Some of it was good, but some robotic and unnatural. What is the catfish talking about? Catfish? One cast, one fish is what you're calling catfish? Yeah. <laughs> so, I just seen robotic and unnatural. He's talking about the footage today. He shot some and he uh, wasn't very happy with it. So, oh. but you never know. You can use snippets out of it here and there and make you know. There's always a use for something. Uh, that video I did. Uh, um, she brought back the East of Montreal. It's completely just. B footage all put together that I had for a long time didn't know what to do with it. 
and then all of a sudden it kind of clicks. For those of you who missed our interview, check it out later and yeah. check our guests. I'm for the last time putting the link in our chat. So check them out if you just haven't. Just in time, prepping. prepping. Hi, hello. Nice to see you. <laughs> Enjoyed your live stream the other night. It was a pleasure to be on with you. Erwin said that I'm always hot. Just needed you to go take a long smoke break. <laughs> Erwin, you got to tell bottle caps to smarten up there. Hey, that's how I roll. How are you? Hello. Welcome. Good to see you. Fortunately, we won't be on too too much longer. We got uh, still the, the end of painting to do up. But wish we could stay on longer, but soon we'll have all that stuff done and be able to spend a little more time with you guys. Yeah, and tomorrow we're going to be here uh, chatting. Uh, Tech Talk last, Tuesday. Last time was half an hour Tech Talk, and then the rest was uh, chit chatting, which was yep. very nice. Exactly. Uh, so just just us, just the two of us, some Tech Talk, and your questions, and your and our answers. Yeah. And uh, see when we get there. We. Uh... Oh, it was our pleasure, just in time. Uh, really enjoyed it. I love how dedicated you are to your your uh, your following on that, and like how you always reference the people and do lots of shout outs and and in depth shout outs and stuff like that. I met some really cool channels off of your uh, your uh, streams and that. Oh wow, you're gonna be doing nine a.m. to noon Mountain Standard Time. That's a good stream. Good for you. I'll try to catch it. Wednesday mornings. That's great. Get Cab 7 on the show? Yeah, I already have talked about that before. Yeah, that's what Keep I Keep behaving as you are, and we're never yeah. going to have Cab 7 on. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, it was a busy day. Well, thank you for, for uh, saying hi yep. and dropping by. Uh, it's, uh, as we always say, it's always nice, uh, even if you can just uh, say hi. I appreciate that a lot. Susie does the same thing too. I do that all the time. I think I'm turning the video on. Actually, I'm turning it off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then you end up with six like videos before you realize when you go back and look at them after it's fumbling around and everything else, getting ready for the next shot, and then nothing. Uh, Steph Opal, such a pleasure having you here. And you take care of yourself. <laughs> She's so sweet. Yes, always so sweet. So appreciate it. We really do appreciate all the kind words. Um, well, yeah, we'll just uh, cross the. Part and then we'll... Should we go off with the black screen? <laughs> Jeez. Oh. Well, have a good night tonight. Uh... For a second, I'm still closing stuff up. Just relax. Less. Less. Easy, easy. I'm just it's more windows to close. Make sure everything is done. Ian, thanks so much for coming. It's good to see you. And by the way, once again, um, I was glad you made it on tonight. Not so. Oh. And who else do we have left? Let's see here. One last chair. So one cast, one fish. There's so many uh, wrenches here. <laughs> uh, bottle caps, of course. Doodles by Doug. Irvin to pay. Oh, who is this now? Yeah, we have had uh, a rage of the worst. Hello, hello. Oh, sorry, because the other night, because I told when I seen Rage, that's what I was thinking of right away. So I do apologize. Yes, now I remember you here. And to show my sincere apologies, you get a moderator. There you go. It's hard to remember sometimes, especially with some of the channels, what's been going on lately. So uh, hopefully we'll, we won't be bothered with that. So. Well, if we do, we have so many mod mods and friends. Exactly. Here, so. And you guys are a great uh, great guests, a great uh, 
guests to have in the chat. Always appreciate all of you. Never Down the rabbit that. hole. Yay. Well, Yay. and you made it for the end uh, of uh, our stream. Mm. Uh, so enjoy the night. Me Mommy needs some me time, doesn't she? <laughs> That's right. Down the rabbit hole. <laughs> you see there's a pattern here, right? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yes, is it your feet or your hands or the ceiling? Anything but what you're supposed to be filming. That's right. <laughs> well, that's okay. We appreciate any time you're here. And I know sometimes when you get a chance, you go back and watch the replay. You can only do what you can. Always remember, guys, real life comes first. No worries about that. Any time you spend with us is about your, part of your valuable time, and we're really, truly appreciative of it. So. I like that uh, the rage, uh, the rage, and all the worst. It's all good, lol. Thank you for your understanding. <laughs> well, guys, I think we have everything closed down, so we're gonna say good night. Remember, Tech Talk Tuesday tomorrow. So we talk some tech. We also shoot the breeze, hang out together. Uh, questions you've got, or you guys want to be able to help other people, it's a great place to do that. We usually put up the promo video in the afternoon and twit. If you guys can share it, it's truly appreciated. We don't hound you, but anything you can do like that is really, really appreciated by us. You guys have a great night. Thank you so much for coming. Cheers and keep creating. Love you all. Love you all. Bye. Take care. Bye now.